he does eventually fold. Good fold. JRP tells him a good fold. But he doesn't fold before losing $218,000 to JRP. I looked at the monitor. When he's on the table, my friend. Huh? He's on the table. You have more you fold, right? Sorry? You have more you fold? Uh, I don't think so, because like, you, you, you don't have Queen up. Jack. You mean, right? stand up. You mean, Maybe, uh, I don't know, I can't fold when I bet 175. Yeah, I, just, I actually thought he would fold 10 Jack on the flop. In that situation, you just say yes. What are you going to do? You can't fold. You'd love to see it. A pure coin flip. Uh-oh. How much is that? 4.50. Easy oh, call. Once or twice. Do you have a pin? Yeah. One pin? Two. You have 2K? Is that no good? It's good, obviously. 893K pot. Buddy, it's our money. We're going three times. Twice, twice. We're going three times. Twice, go, twice. Stop. It's our money. We're going three times. Wait. There's no ruling. It's our money. We're going three times. Louis, I think we should let Yes, he wanted it, and I agree. Louis, I think we should let Matt, we said we are going to give you five. Three, three, three. Okay, you guys can run it three times. Chill. I hope he gets one. Actually, I'm adding a million five. Oh, keep adding, Ben. I love it. Love it. Empty that thing out. What's going on in that bag? Can I get one of them bags? Brian, give me a bag. What the fuck brand is that bag? It's a bottomless pit of fucking shit. Pulling out Monopoly money. Can you, can we, you, you want to get an exact count of jail these shits? <laughs> I'll do it for you. 500. Hey buddy, stay off my stack. One, two, Mind two, your business. One, one, two, two, one, what is one, exactly? Three, is, it, yeah, is, is, one, that, two, seven, is that proper etiquette? Then we'll chop me down. 1285. Ben's on tilt. You guys chop me down like And I'm here for it. Adding 1.5 million over bet. Make the best fold of my life ever here. With a straighter of flush. Wow, Rob is not raising. He's considering folding. This would be the fantastic. Best fold of my life. Just, I, the I, idea of folding is absurd. 83. Hey. How do I not win infinite in this hand? <laughs> this guy is so disrespectful. That's what he said, right? The hands that would probably fold. Call a clock on the turn. It's a thousand big blind deep pot. Someone's calling the clock on the turn. Wesley catching up on some sleep. Sure. What are we doing? Oh, oh, you in. I know I win, probably. Uh-oh. Just if I'm shoving or not. It's if I shove the river or not. I'm never folding. It's if I shove the river or not. Do I shove or not? Of course you shove. No, it's pretty close. Of course you shove. It's definitely close. Pretty close. These two used to have beef, Doug and Tom. There's two combos. There's six, seven, two, and king, six, suited. They fold in? Yeah. Let's go. All right, I'm back in the mix. <laughs> Who is this guy? Did you three bet? Yeah. I guess. I guess now we know how to. Let's go. Let's go. Who's left? Just these two. Hands? Oh, that's not cool. Okay, see you Guess what? The trap was set. However, Rob slithered his way out of it. See how red Tom Blanc's face is there. Really frustrated. Annoyed. <laughs> Can't even look at him. Guys up like three million. This <laughs> is one pot. <laughs> He looks like he's. Oh, he looks like. One bread, he looks like he's just like on the verge of death. Very sympathetic. Very sympathetic. You got like one bread, the boy. Hundred and twenty-five thousand dollars in the biggest pot we've seen so far today, and Tony G on the wrong side of it. Two hundred thousand dollar bet from JRB, and Rob very quickly makes the call, and we've got an eight hundred and twenty-six thousand dollar pot, biggest pot of the night. No, he lets it go. And Keating shows. This, this time it was, yeah. Yeah, it should be two, yeah. He's, he's two. Yeah. Didn't do this time, well, this time it was. Because there's already action, so. You can't change action now. Well. One thing about you is you always know shit. <laughs>
And we have a cooler. Top two against bottom set. I fear for Alan Keating's stack there. Boat over boat. I fear no more. Keating is going to win a huge one. I'm the only guy putting real chips in the, in the pot. And you guys are all sitting there snug, snuggling it up and then and, and don't want to fucking... Okay. Don't worry about it, dude. I'm, I'm, I'm stuck 220 after after playing eight minutes. And you guys want to change the uh, change lines. It's all right. Go ahead. You guys start rocking and rolling and then have something to say. And JRB is going to call quickly... And aces for max value. Wow, well, aces, that, that's a setup. I, I, I am about to win you about how little I want in the hand, though. <laughs> <laughs> JRB's the best. <laughs> <laughs> if, if it's just like a fucking three on the river, you just, I get him for like a 200 ball. Nick Airball with jocks. Oh, okay. Where do you... I don't, I don't know where he he's gonna muck. He's gonna around a lot. Oh, that's fine. Probably yep. Probably some, 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 some. You gotta get a change of scenery. What's that? You gotta get a change of scenery. Yeah, yeah, I like that. I like that. I like Chicken nuts. He could have, he could have had it. And he would have flopped a set of jocks here. And he's gonna get paid off. Rampage here. Trips over trips. And he lays it down. Wow. And of course, Airball has Hold to show. Aces. Fucking stinks. That was like a fucking setup hand. That's like fucking unbelievable. That's just not, not normal. Folded aces? That's like fucking sick. Okay. I quit, I quit, I quit, I quit. I, quit. I, I play, I play, I quit. It's okay, I quit. I play. On your bike! <laughs> On your bike, Tony! You and your aces! Back to Santa Monica! <laughs> I have never seen that. He's gonna... That's. <laughs> I know. You're playing for <laughs> And that's why it's great for the game. <laughs> Not that I care. Uh, yeah, I'm uh, so happy to bluff the guy. I, I didn't know about the stand up game. I didn't even show it. <laughs> <laughs> so, so Boogie looks like he just you ran three miles on the beach in the middle of summer. What's up? Forgot nice to put sunscreen on. Damn it. 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. Are you careful? Mine's always in play. Take it. Oh. Yes. Oh, oh, she's got the ace. Damn it. Oh, I didn't think she had it. Nice hand, honey. Oh. DK is going to take this one down. Oh. Oh, I tried. I tried. I would have lost that So that's the stand-up game, too, that's, that caused Alex to do that, I think. She's still looking for her marker, along with Raver, Hillary, and I believe Brazil God. Me and Badger. Yeah, he's scared. Yeah, I was scared. He, he's trying to make the, the nuts, otherwise he doesn't bet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah that, that's, that's that's he's, scared, he's scared that you might check mm. raise bet bet with him, right? Yeah. Scared. Yo, this is out of line. This is out of line. I'm dumber than I look. <laughs> well done, Wesley. Well done, Wesley. <laughs> Isn't everyone else with three bet with ace queen? What? Except for you. <laughs> everyone else except you with three bet with ace queen. Are you deaf? Yes. Look at that look. Pretty good. So, Shimi, you're in trouble the rest of the way. Oh, there's a Jack. Come and see one go to town. What's up? Today, Jack, what's your card? Wow. Oh, and there's the, another Jack. Emergency school. And Sashimi needs a king, or Peter is going to scoop, and he does. Gets it in bad. 
and wins a pot of almost $133,000. Uh, so Nick does get the scoop. Brittany finds both the fours. Oh, he folds. Wow, I did not see that coming. And of course, we're gonna have to take a closer look. Five. Hey, 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 that's you, that's you, now, that's you. Now six yeah. will come, see. Okay, Satoshi. Two pair. <laughs> For Satoshi and Anthony looks sick. Now six will come. Oh, nine! He's Trip dead! Nines. He's dead! <laughs> What's Mariano doing? What is, why is he smiling? It's snapped off by Charles's flush. And Charles wins a $142,000 pot with seven deuce of clubs. Blocker, did you put your what blocker a strange off? hand. Do you think this is PLO? Do you think your blockers work here, Professor? Crafts doesn't come my way. I know, right? What hey, is everybody. going on here? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, you got some right here. <laughs> so painful, man. Looks like he's gonna release, and we're gonna see it, and both Mars and Andy are gonna jump out of their seats. Let's gamble. Oh my god. god. Fuck, man, I knew it. I, I, I had a feeling too, Mars. It's 7-5, it's not even 5-8. Five, five, eight. Eight. Five, eight. Five, eight. Right? I have three sides, the other hand. God damn. Not even 5-8. I, I also do the black, black on top. Back it up. Look at this. Oh, oh, man. oh my god. You win. Oh, the ace on the turn. Wow. Watch out, watch out, Mars. Ace queen. Ace queen down. You win. Lucas got King Jack. That's the read. Did they side? Yeah. Let me see. Nice. That's good, eh? Call. He calls! Look at that! Shit, how can you get aces so easily? Max value! You had a bear you got, I can have. Lucas got an 80. Key, you have, I mean, you have an out. Good thing. Key! Oh my god. I can I'm so tilted. Two points, anyone can get it. Nice him. Give him another 10k, Link, Link, do something. Queens again, Finally, Professor does let it go. What a bluff from Stanley. Oh, a bluff? Wow. Hey, hey. You'll see Nicely straight, done. Right? Yeah, almost caught. But somehow I changed my mind in the last minute. There's sunburn. Oh, you went. Break oh. out. Yeah. Six, three o'clock. Since three o'clock? Oh yeah, they had to get on. Oh, That's a lot to miss. Thanks for pointing that out. Ling Ling. Work hard. Thank you. <laughs> Not for me, this guy. Jeremy, look who's doing it. No, no, no. You still hate your seat? Your old friend, Magic. I know, he was trying to steal JTC. Comes and goes. I get 40k. Not for me, this guy. Jeremy, look who's doing it. No, no, no. You still hate your seat? Your old friend, Magic. I know, he was trying to steal JTC. Comes and goes. I get 40k. Well, there's an eight. He doesn't have to worry about it. Yeah, he makes the gutter. All in. And all in. It's only 138,000. Yeah. You gotta let it go correctly. Lock, 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 they're, they're gonna split this three ways. Ridiculous, what a run out. I mean, this is a chop. So sick. 
Chop it up. I oh, yeah. it oh my god, I didn't wrote this big. I thought it was dead. Yeah. Oh my god. I it. That's what I said. Hillary and Nate are both tilted for different reasons. <laughs> the last time I did here the other week, I lost too. Oh, there's 34,000 people. Just try. What? You got to try to do it hard to me physically. Ooh, there you uh -oh. go. Talk to lock yeah. in. Try. You, you want to try to me physically? Yeah, try, try, try. Hit me. We can go outside if yeah, you want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit me. Try. Come outside. Try. 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 Come at him. Ball? Hit me. Right, no balls. No balls. Oh, this is out of line. Look at Luis coming. He's running in. I'm he said you love to hurt me physically. Then he opened up his body. You saw how he opened up his body? I saw that. I thought he was going to try He said, hit me. Lock in. And he started talking to Nick. Yeah. I was talking to Nick, and he started talking to Nick. Nah, you weren't talking to Nick. Stop it. It just felt like it was building. Christian, who do you got in a fist fight? I don't know. Dude. I got Wesley, man. Yo, Wesley, Wesley's Wesley locked in. Fierce. He turned his body and said, do something. They, they really go at it, right? He wasn't passive about it. Yeah, big pot energy here. This looks like it's probably going to ball in. It is. Rip it. All of it. 715,000 in the middle. Two boards, Sammy. Oh! Wow. Man. Up. The River Queen. How much can you buy him for? As much as you want. Third. Third best player in China. I don't think Wesley counts as a player. You have to play hands to be a player. He's a spectator that sits at the table. I don't see how he can fold Chuck. Oh, you got it, you got it. There you go, you got it, you got it. And he does have it. Wow. Good hand. That's the cooler we've been waiting for for two days. It was bound to happen. You play enough poker, you see enough hands, it's going to happen. Can't really beat much. He, he does lets lay it down. go. Ben making all the wrong moves right now. I didn't wow. think there was a world where he folded that. I thought. Yeah, he's I tilted thought. out of his mind right now. He's gonna take a walk. Up. There's the Ben tilt walk. I mean, I would like to say one day. I just lost like 850 k. I was from before there. I was from before. I hear him. Yes, it is. He was the turn. I never get cold by I sure, dude. Are you kidding me? I sure as hell would. Airball. I know, even if I'm wrong, Rick, Rick would be happy for me to call, even if I'm wrong. I know that. Sick hearing this. And he'd be really pissed if Barn. I pulled. Clock. Airball calls the clock. Desperation move. How many seconds? Hands dead. Nick Airball gets it through. You guys all are playing tight. Let's play, let's fucking gamble. Come on, Jeremy, call. Rick's screaming at you. Listen to your boss, call. Come on, Huss. But if you let me call, I would've called. Airball. Let's go. What a More timely gambling, clock call. Let's bluff, come on. I think that was the difference. Put these guys to the test, Rob. Let's show them how his bosses play. You were right, Rick. I should have listened to you. Rick, that was for you, baby. You win. Slow roll. Good call, Leslie. You finally put money in the pot. Well done, Leslie. Yeah. You can see him saying whatever he wants about me. If he wants to put on my mom, then. Yeah, he crossed the line. What you gonna do? I don't talk to him. I'm not gonna not talk to him. He just talked. I'm not gonna not talk to him. <laughs> and he's gonna fold, and Rampage gets it through. Oh my god. Unbelievable. We got a game! Wow. Hand. Hand. hand of the weekend. Kids got heart. Did I lost a 25 picture? No, you blinded it out, bro. <laughs> Come on, Wes. You, you can't just give him the, the alley-oop like that. At the end of the stand-up game, heads up for rolls. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Heads up for a mill. So at the end of the stand-up game, they're going to play one hour heads up. And 
Hands is stuck. Hands is, stuck. Hands is like, he's smiling, but he's hating it. He's like, really? I'm losing, man. Uh, I feel like it's a bluff. Bluff? No one time bluff. But you want to see it here? Uh, <laughs> shout out is really wrong. Queen Deuce. I actually going to bluff him no matter what. Oh. Tilting my hand. Come here, God damn it. Win 13,000 with the third best hand in a three-way pot. You do? I had the best. You locked it up. See, my Sam City. He locked it up, buddy. Right now, all you have to do is just say raise, he full. <laughs> 274,000. <laughs> Let's see if he's going to get a raise in here. No, he's just going to call the entire way. Smooth called the entire way in a $200,000 pot for Tony G. Bro, you know what to ask me. I got called. I said, they woke me up with a call. They said, there might be a seat for you. 20 minutes later, I was here with a beer in my hand ready to go. We've I seen... nearly pulled it. If you bet 160, I'm... Wow. I'd put you down like... Mm. It just didn't bet enough. That was one of the bigger... If you ever bet the pot, I would have folded. I think I can bluff sometimes. Wow. He's going to show it. It's scary when they call your cards out and you're bluffing, right? Yeah. <laughs> Not money until you have to explain it to your wife. <laughs> Just kidding, she doesn't get it. I'm not calling three times. Try to trap you, because I think you're weak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at those chips. What's stacks and stacks. Right I gotta make rent this month. Clock, everybody, everybody clock. clock. Me! Hold! Hold! Chop, 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 chop. <laughs> DK's gonna win it with a pair of deuces and collect the bounty. <laughs> What an absurd head. Thank you so much. And he's angling me in the fucking three seat. Oh, it's over. It's over. It's, it's over. It's over. It's It's over. 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 It's
I've never seen this before. If he show me that, he's gonna have that beard. If he show me that, he's gonna have me that beard. You that's that's how it's finally, some energy. finally. She didn't even give me a second to moan about it. That's, that's me. That's me. That's me. That's me. See? Fuck you, Apple. Get the no. Get the member out of the body.
only pass through this life once. When you get old, all you're gonna have left is your memories. So make them good. Never fold. Lord to the game and the bankroll. We gon' add it up when we get low. I know my life is black, I'm a chat pro. All in, let's go. Monday through Friday, what should we do? Catch us streaming live right on YouTube. ACL family, this is our house. Keating on the show, bet it all now. J Boogie, walk away, never overplay. Max value, max pain, this is not a game. Hit that thumbs up, let's go for a ride. Come and join the stream, we're starting at five. Raise it up. Chat Pro. From high above Hustler Casino here in beautiful Los Angeles. This is Hustler Casino Live brought to you by High Stakes Poker Productions. I'm Charlie Wilmoth here with you for an evening of high stakes. 5100 no limit hold'em. We've got Mariano in the building. We've got Nick Airball in the building. This is going to be a good one, and I'm excited to see what these players have in store here on Friday night on HCL. So now heading inside the crystal room here in Hustler Casino. See our players getting ready to go. See Mariano. <laughs> See Nick Airball half asleep. Got Mike X, Dylan Flashner. This should be a good one. <laughs> There's me on the graphic. I haven't seen that one before. You didn't even ask me how I go 97, whatever. No, I started with 40. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, yeah. Wow. It was oh, not 100, it was 90 on Oh, my God. So I go to the cage and the Adam. So let's meet our players. Here's Dylan Flashner, actor and producer. He's been on the show a lot lately. He's played some of the smaller stakes games, and now he's playing Friday as well. This is Dan, an entrepreneur and poker enthusiast. Digging the Red Rugrats t-shirt. Mike X, Mike X Poker on Twitter. Joining us in seat six. One of my favorite people who plays on the show. And this is Steiner, the winner, outright winner of the last two Arizona State Poker Championships in seat seven. Nick Airball, professional artist, playing heads up seven up in seat eight. And Mariano, vlogger on YouTube and a reg here on HCL in seat nine. So let's look at our chip counts courtesy of Odds Jam. Bunch of players buying in for 100,000 down to Several others buying in for 20k, and we're going to be playing 5100 with a $100 big blind ante. I'm told Pepe and Baba were late scratches today, very late scratches. 
So they will not be playing. And we'll see if anyone else files in later in the evening. But we're going to be starting off six-handed here tonight. Steiner. Nice hand to start with. Just, yeah, it's not. I mean, not everybody's handsome as you are, so you just, you know. Dan yeah, defends. And the jack in the window for Steiner. Gutter for Dan. Dan calls here. a small bet. And Binks on the turn has Steiner drawing dead. The nut straight. I went like five minutes past it before. And I think, from Steiner's perspective, certainly a good spot to value bet. The same road as, for example, at least it going to war. should seem that way to him. We can see that he's in deep trouble. Instead of going because it's just subconsciously. Turn raises have not been bluffed since the Truman administration, but. You got to try when you got the nuts here. You know, Dylan? Looks like he's on, a, on an island. So yeah, and Steiner <laughs> is going to make the call. <laughs> 10,000 in there. And that's a card that might just save Steiner from further damage. Can you tell our room for how big a stack is going to be by the end of the night? Yeah. 13,000, basically an all in here. And I think this is an annoying but pretty straightforward fold with King Jack. Rainbow board on the turn. Not a lot of natural bluffs. Turn raises are under bluffed. And Steiner does let it go. Easy to say, I think, that Dan's bet was too big on the river, but we know that Steiner only had one pair, and I, I do think that a lot of players on the show, if they have two pair, which is pretty easy to do on that board, are going to at least consider paying that off. So raise for Mike, three calls. And top pair of jacks from Mike. Dan again with the gutter. So sort of a replay of last hand, except Dan's not going to turn the nuts this time. Mike has the ace of spades. Doesn't need to bet here, I don't think. And a whiff from Dan. And he's going to bluff. Mike with a decent bluff catcher here. Ten high. Snaps it off. And Mike wins the second pot of the night. Is that what you had last hand, Dan? <laughs> well, ten high would have been a straight shot last hand. There's so many connected cards. <laughs> The 51. Yeah. I guess we'll find out in about an hour. Yeah, just ask him. He always tells people what I ask. Oh, yeah? yeah. First one, I you get a bluff through or you, you flop it? Or I had a good hand, yeah. You had a good hand? Yeah, that's it. We have a good hand. Now we know. He's a good guy. Is this a drinking lineup today? Shit. <laughs> <laughs> we never know. Steiner and Dan both probing for information here. Starter for all drinking purposes, right? Yeah, we'll just get a bottle of wine and more drinks. I'm sorry, what happened? 300. 300 is all you, baby. 
Yeah, you can get a cocktail waitress. Real action here for Dylan. He kind of slowed down. You can get a cocktail waitress. There's less drinking on the table. Yeah. What was your name again? Here we go. Lauren. Sorry, Lauren. I'm so sorry. Like for drinking, you need a buddy. You know, you need somebody to just at least one person. If it's two, three, then it's kind of. I'm still waiting on uh, you, Mike. One of these days. Crack that safe. Can you today, please? Two, three. Three. <laughs> you don't want me drunk. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, can I just get a Modelo? Modelo? Yeah. So, no, does anyone else here want to drink? Is that no? Our oh, bottle's good. Yeah, for sure. Thank you. It's a lot of trouble. Some Mariano with a very light open. Yeah. Fops middle pair, Mike X with top pair. Checks through, Steiner picks up a gutter. He gets out of the way and Mariano will peel here facing a small bet. Andy Rivers trips, wow. I think you can actually probably just get out of the way on the turn in Mariano's shoes, but if you're going to river trips, it's all good. And here comes the raise. is on Mariano. He does raise, and I would have to think that my opponent is would be pretty special to call with Ace-8 here. Sort of like the hand between Dan and Steiner. This river raise is extremely underbluffed. Not that Mariano's not capable, though. Mike does pay it off. Mariano running hot, as usual. Suited Broadway for Dylan. Raise. Raise it up. One Dan in there, the ace nine off. All right. Getting the sense here that Dan is not going to be the tightest player at the table. Six. Mariano, cold four bets. The bluff aces gets the best hand out of the way. Dan with one of the worst free bets he would probably ever have, I'm just guessing. Gets out of the way, as does Mike. Another pot for Mariano. You had it? I had a pretty good hand. I think I had it, yeah. but I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> yeah. He did not have it. Yeah. Yeah, you can yeah. keep the change. Thank, Thank you. you. Next one's on me, Dan. Thank All right, you. cool. Ace five suited is almost like having it. You can you can bluff somebody with ace five suited, and then then show them ace five suited, and they'll treat it as if you had pocket kings or something. Like that's totally understandable that you would bluff with that hand. You were bluffing, but you weren't being disrespectful. Thank you. 
So Steiner in August. How you been, Dylan? Good, how you doing? Good, buddy. Won the Arizona State Poker Thanks. Championship for $262,000. Repeating yeah. his win from the previous year yeah, it's, uh, in 2022, yeah. won it outright for $221,000. How long have you had that shirt? Uh, not long, like six months. Oh, yeah. okay. So you just found it. Somewhere. Found it, yeah. Open for Mariano, a couple calls, and a nice flop for tens. Mariano, check that back, wow. Sneaky check back. I don't know much about Dan, but Dylan, not a huge bluffer, which makes me want to just go ahead and bet the pocket tens on the flop. They need a lot of protection, and they're likely to be best. Regardless, Mariano's gonna try to squeak out two streets of value here against Dan, which might be kind of tricky. And he does. Mariano's line did not make much sense to Dan. Might have gotten him a little bit more value than if he had played it the way I recommended it. Out here, play the LAPC. Sweet. Ten thousand <clears> dollar, excuse me, ten thousand dollar tournament at one of the other LA casinos this weekend that Steiner is referring to. It's the uh, buying for the main event there. Ten. Four. Is there a guarantee? I don't. I don't know. I don't know if there's a guarantee or not. I've heard kind of conflicting things on whether it's like going to be big or small or good or bad. Cheers, Mariano. Salud. You're not you're not really an attorney player, right? Are you? Yeah. Hardly a cash player. <laughs> <laughs> Another one. So top and bottom for Mike, who raised yeah, the flop. I actually, I played. Got here yesterday, played in a satellite yesterday, and won my seed. Sweet. So that's why I have today off now. I was going to fire another satellite today. Yeah, but beautiful. I don't have to. I just happened to. So uh, one case, Addy? Yeah. 28. Found out there was a seed, and I said, let's do it. Let's play. So Dylan, I think, can let this go at this point. He does. Stone Malik saying Steiner just qualified for the LAPC in the satellite last night, and I got knocked out on the stone bubble. It's brutal. Try, try again for Dylan here. And again, Mariano with tens. You obviously live down uh, in LA. Just calls. Oh, nice, there we and a pretty nice board to see about here. Dylan with 
got shot to the nuts. Not a great flaw for Ponca Tens, and Mariano pitches him. Collection. Stone Malik says, got knocked out by Francisco the Pro. So if you want to play on Hustler Casino Live and you don't necessarily have the bajillion dollars necessary to play in this game, you should come down to the casino on Monday where there'll be ha a drawing for a 5K seat to play on Max Payne Monday. So a seat and a 5K bankroll to start, a 5K stake. LAPC? Yeah. The main event is tomorrow. Okay, cool. But it's like a month long or two month long, like there's a bunch of little so tourneys. This is like the ending of it, right? Yeah, I think so. Main events are near the end? Oh. I think so. There might be some smaller tourneys afterwards too, just okay. closing up type stuff, but I don't know, this is my first time playing it or being out here for it. Mm -hmm. Nick Airball literally wakes up with Ace King. He's had his head on the table. A lot so far this evening. Probably just got out of bed. And a pretty Nasty flop for Ace King. So Nick Arabal out of position, checks it over. Steiner checks back. Interesting turn card. Nick with the king of clubs. Thinks his Ace King might already be good though. Steiner with similar thoughts about his pocket fives. And checks good. He's gonna win a small one. Nick, one of several stream players who were in the mix in the, the 5 5 10 or 5 5 10 20 game with. Me and a bunch of other hustler regulars earlier this week. Jeremy Levin played as well. DK. Nick won. Something like eleven thousand dollars in just a few hours, which is not easy to do in that game, and then lost it all within ten minutes on the stream that night. Test, test. Yeah. What do you want me to do? Say, say something. So they can see if your mic is working or not. We're good. We're good. I'm not used to being so quiet. <laughs> Mike is broken. Check. Making sure Nick's okay. Four. All right. John Juanda for Mike X. Some decent suited hands make the call. And Dan with 9 8 off as well. Jacks still good. Five. 
Small bet for Mike. And what's Dan got cooking up? Nothing. Looked like he thought about making a move there. Maybe thinking how many tens does Mike really have in his range? <laughs> struggle bus tonight <laughs> on the technology. Nick just staring into space as we sort out some audio issues here. Seven, I think. <laughs> I believe Nick has said that he, he frequently wakes up at like 3 p.m. <laughs> We're on an hour delay, so that was probably about an hour and a half ago. The jack for Mike, and a flush draw as well. about it later you can beat it yeah yeah you learn it from nikki <clears throat> okay right. i can sell you a course what what's the plan how many casinos do we want to get banned from <laughs> <laughs> Mariano with a suited ace. Dylan makes the call. Mariano checks out of position, turns trips. Wow, Dylan calling with King High. Be a sick call. <laughs> what do you have? It'd be a wrong King call. <laughs> and nice Dylan does make the call. They killed your mojo. King no, High. <laughs> I had to do it one time just to keep you honest. Yeah. <laughs> I do that too. Oh, they had it again? Oh, okay. Careful. <laughs> Wake up, buddy. DT. <laughs> See these guys falling asleep in their chairs at the casino. And you have to prod them to get them to look at their cards. And then they sit bowled upright and four bet you. It's one of the worst feelings in poker. Middle pair for Mariano. He's had the best hand a lot tonight so far. This doesn't feel like a board where Dan's going to get tons of folds, but Mariano does have one of those hands that is going to let it go. Mike, we 
should go play that tournament everyone's doing tomorrow. The 10,000 man yeah, match yeah. that Steiner's tournament. Might as well. Shout out to... We'll probably make the, the last table, the final table. Yeah. Ben and final Nikki and like Rudy working the floor. Yeah, no problem. Okay. Three. Here giving you a heads up. in the crystal room. Yeah. Obviously, he's going to be there and win it. So. Yeah. All what do you say, Mike? We can't play on stream next Wednesday because we'll be at the final table. Well, next week, next Wednesday is the final table. Yeah, so I'll be out of country, so oh. yeah. There you go. Guys got lucky. <laughs> Let them live. Are you serious? You want to play? Oh, Mike, I know. I never heard you even play one tournament, let yeah. alone ten k Yeah. Yeah. Do you ever play tournaments? Not even the main. Um, I didn't this time. I did two years ago. Mariano has vlogged about playing the main before. You get one shot. One shot. One opportunity. Exactly. To seize everything you ever wanted. One moment. Amen. The Mom's Spaghetti Tournament at Commerce. Sure. That'd be a great day. Yeah, it sounds dramatic, but even in the stream, you have vomit on your shirt. Feels like somebody should have a straight here, but nobody does. I'm a nit, but not that much of a nit. <laughs> <laughs> Nick Airball <laughs> just moves in. What did you say? I'm a nit, but not that much of a nit, you know? <laughs> what was that, 10x spot? <laughs> I think more than that. Big bet. But you weren't expecting that, huh, Dylan? I wasn't. <laughs> it's a great move. I can't call it. Tough to play against that. Um, I'm hopeless against that. Maybe that's what Nick needed to wake up here. Would you have small straight? <laughs> small straight, he would raise. <laughs> Yeah, put the reload on the table. It's like, hey, hold on, I had some chips I left in my pocket. I didn't need much to call it down. <laughs> I, yeah. I called down everything, so. Called down with King High earlier. Yeah. A little bit, a little bit different that time. Yeah. So bad. So our cumulative winnings, courtesy of Odds Jam, Mariano, up almost 10,000. Dylan stuck five, Steiner stuck four. <sighs> Fuck me. He does look a little bit more awake. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> you guys want to add any kind of like prop games or something? Yeah, no. Spice things up. You could do stand up. If I had to guess what unspeakable things means, it's yeah, whatever. winning or losing six figures at high-stakes PLO. No, I'm out. No? Seven dudes? Just guessing. Nothing? Sweet? <laughs> Too much paying attention. Side games. Are you sure your cards? Check. 
top pair and a backdoor flush draw for Mike X. Thursday morning. Next Thursday. Next Thursday. ISO here from airball in position. Very big PLO has been running here at Hustler. 10, 20, 40. Running almost every day. Do you hear from Wesley? Do you hear from him? Wesley, Wesley. Sometimes. Is he okay? Just doesn't play? Airball plays the big PLO sometimes, suited Superman. Frequently in the mix. Sometimes also Brown Balla, Saya Ono, Adam Johnson, who commentated last night. It's been interesting to see that some very high stakes public PLO coming together. Set of eights for Dan. Be pretty hard for him to get much action though. Now quads. Dan checked back the flop. Now you gotta try. Using a big sizing here, excuse me, a big sizing here, hoping it looks bluffy. Maybe he can trick Dylan to putting in a bet, but nah. for the three betting chips. Dan, cold calls it. Steiner can certainly call as well.
three of you now. So three ways to a flop. And a very nice flop for Dylan, although he's dominated by Dan's King Queen. Not anymore. Top two now for Dylan. Lots of stuff that will pay him now. Good spot to bet big and keep Dan stuck in this pot. And Dylan's going to have about three quarters pot back for this river. Flush comes in, but it's a backdoor flush. I think I would like to see a jam. Dan quickly checks back the king queen, and Dylan not happy with himself. Spin and win with a new out of this world feature on WPT Global. Global Spins give you the chance to invest a little and win galaxy-sized prizes. To celebrate the launch, WPT Global is giving away over $18,000 every week. Get in on the action by using the code HUSTLER and get our welcome package with deposit match and a chance to win Global Spins tickets. That's right, WPT Global will match your deposit with a first time bonus. Sign up for the welcome package at WPTGlobal.com using code HUSTLER. Porters are bringing around hors d'oeuvres tonight because it's player appreciation day here at Hustler. Food is already free or reduced price in a lot of the bigger games, but they're bringing around some special stuff that isn't on the menu. So Steiner turns a queen. Not much there for Mike. He bluffs the river and pretty straightforward call spot for Steiner. Oh, there it is. Original. <laughs> yeah. Didn't work. Didn't work. Didn't have the block. Mike X. It's supposed to be Jack of Clubs, four of hearts. Can I just see what I think I saw? Get it right next time. Thank you. The J, the J4 got the old. Race from Dan. Mike makes the call. And a 10 on the turn. 
Okay. Three hundo full. How much your birthday, man? Thank you, How old is the Old enough to do? Yeah. Some dude. Makes sense. Now you know. Thank you. You also from Los Angeles area, right? Sorry? You also from Los Angeles area. No, I just visit. Oh, really? What's that? A few times a year from Toronto. Oh, yeah. Toronto. Canada, wow. All right. Uh, a couple businesses. Had no idea. 1300. Yeah. I love it here, obviously. Toronto is a beautiful city. It is. Uh, it's cold, though. It's cold. But I visited. Three or four times, but mostly we went over here. Okay. Yeah. Um, Five. I really enjoy uh, LA Winters. Playing this three bed pot mid conversation here. Yeah. Yeah. Three. Twenty five hundred. Everything is relative, right? So when you say it's cold here. Prices like that. You know, I had a customer from Wisconsin and so uh, you know, them calling California, they usually first ask questions. Do you play there in Arizona? Like, yeah, it's kind of or cold. It's like yeah. 65 oh, or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's, it's uh, nice and warm here. If you haven't been there in the last yeah. one month, it's yeah. only yeah. Even that, degrees, a couple weeks, you know, I think, when they open the room. I heard about it. Way, I don't understand that because their room was already so full. Like, minus 20 or 30. So, like, 30 feels. Any room. Like yeah, as far as number of tables, like temperature uh, spaces, and t-shirt same spot or just same spot. Okay, so they just, 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 just like had been building it for like two yeah. years, added like I love section it, adjacent. Which way it. did they go though? Because I know like the casino is on the front of it, and then on the sides they have like restrooms and like the parking lot. They like took some oh, parking shit. lot spot. Holy! Oh wow! Yeah, like they really outside the yeah. Casino. Wow. Yeah. Come visit. Yeah, I'll check it out. Let's go. Heads up. Damn, with another light three bet. This one very light. Checks back his pair of fives. Yeah, I'd love to go make a vlog over there. The radar. Not much there for Dylan. He lets it go. Shout out to Sean Yapel, Hustler Casino GM in the chat. Even if the game's not like big, I don't care. I'm down to play whatever. Yeah, but it, no, it would be sick to have a vlog for it. Yeah, it would be cool. Hmm. Let me talk to some people. All right. Whereabouts in Arizona do you live? Uh, right there, Scottsdale. Love Scottsdale. Yeah, fine. Five, ten minutes from like So many good food spots there. There's a lot. Yeah. There's a lot of good stuff. Brattle's on the thing. Five. Five and no. Watch draw for Steiner. 250. Dan has been quite active in the early going, but. Check. Defending very wide. Does turn the best hand here somehow, though. Check, check. Dance Queen is good.
Thank you, Dan. Yeah, last time I was at Talking Stick was right when COVID was starting. Mm -hmm. And they hadn't shut anything down yet. It was just like, you know, hey, this thing is coming up. And so it's been a while. So it's been a while. Maybe things have changed, like, rules-wise yeah. for that. I remember I was in the casino, and they were forcing us to wear a mask. Yeah. And that was, like, the first time I'd ever been forced to wear a mask. And I was like, oh, my God, they're crazy over here. <laughs> Fast forward six months, you can't yeah, go anywhere yeah. without one. No, they got they, they ended up doing, like, plastic barriers. Yeah. Like, I know they did a lot of that here, too. Uh -huh. But... I'll celebrate Chinese we'll see what's up. Yeah. I remember when the whole like lockdown was supposed to be one week only yeah, or two weeks maybe. Yeah. Oh boy. Kings against Ace King suited. Dan's been so active. He's not going to want to back down easily and maybe not at all. Okay. There's a four bet. And this is for about a third of Dylan's chips. It looks really strong, but I'm not really sure what Dan can do about it. He shoves. Dylan snaps it off. Seems a little bit reluctant, but does quickly make the call. I've changed. I don't know if that. Twice is good. Twice? Two times. Okay. Biggest Sorry. pot of the night so far, $37,000. Uh oh, Dylan. Oh, let's go. Two times. Yeah. I'll buy your hand if you don't want to, you want to gamble. I'll gamble it. It's fine. <laughs> Thanks, Nick. We'll, we'll see. <laughs> and you guys are running it twice? Yeah. yeah. Nothing there for Dan. And Dylan wins the first run out. Always nice to be able to pull back your chips and free roll the second run out. Three of spades is nice. Jack now will give Dan the win, but two jacks are on the first flop. Ooh, there's the jack, and they're going to chop this up. Dan makes Broadway on the second run out, gets his money back. Thank you, Dan. Should have bought it. Well, I mean, dude. Even even money, you chopped it anyway. So, yeah. Mike, are you I never on your, your about big line? Oh, I, I thought the jacks like, were blocked. I know. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of jacks. I understood spades. That made sense to me. How about just a good old fashioned ace? Yeah, right. An you ace. Know? Yeah, ace ball. Nick with the raise, big re-raise from Dan. Six X, almost seven X. And not the worst flop for Ace Five suited. A pretty big C bet from the situation from Dan. Nick Airball makes the call with some back doors and hits a pair of nines. I mean, I know it's like a Not a great turn card so for Dan. But not one that's supposed to change all that much either. He keeps firing. Figures that when he has an over pair here, it's still very likely to be good. 
Plus with Ace-5 suited, he does have some outs. Nick makes the call. And Queen on the river. And does Dan want to try something here to hopefully get Nick's 10x to fold? And unless Airball has some sick read on Dan. 14 more. A big bet here should work. This might be a bit small, but it still does put a pair of nines at least in a very annoying spot. Nick's got the call in his hand. Oh, you win. He snaps it off, and he's going to win the biggest pot of the night so far. Almost fifty thousand dollars. I'm very hard. Turning to a pair of nines. <laughs> But I appreciate the effort. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Dan, good sport. So Nick Airball now up 25,000. Mariano up 10K. And Dan, newcomer from Toronto, stuck 27K. As you look at our cumulative winnings, courtesy of Odds Jam. Oh, my bad. Oh, you're not allowed to. It's just, I didn't think you were. <laughs> nah. I think it's 25k I'm gonna have. 25? Yep. Copy. Raise, three hundo. Raise. Make it 1,000. Button's good. Dan, it's been by far the most, I mean, I don't know, I guess we'll see the numbers, but it feels like by far the most active player tonight, and he just tried to run a three-barrel bluff in a three-bet pot against Nick Airball, and people in the chat are still calling him a nit. I feel like people's definitions of that word have shifted an awful lot. You know, it's, uh, every Friday, yeah, it's Friday or last yeah. Friday of the month is yeah. Player oh. Appreciation Day. Oh. So is that what those scallops were for? They yeah. have. Con oh, I never put two and two together. Uh, I thought it was just random treats an, here and there. Every, <laughs> every half an hour, they have uh, food and yeah. you know, dessert and food and drinks. Uh, Bring this. Giant, buck giant buckets of ice cream. Start serving ice cream. Ice cream? Yeah. All right, now we're talking. They are wild. Probably hit the jackpot or something. No? No idea what's going on down there. Don't disagree at all. 11 hundo. poker but not succeeding. Turn off your phone. <laughs> I like keep telling myself I need to do other things and then I just don't. Thank you so much. Appreciate 300. it. 300. Wait, see it. Yeah, I think about One way of possibly doing it is just really. uh, does anyone want to drink? Two thousand. You I make a weekly schedule, all right? Saturdays Saturday, Sunday, um, like this week, I'm making my next week's schedule. 
So when you fill up the spots, you only have time. Jan dominated. And it's sort of annoying with Steiner stock to have to call here, but certainly you can. 60 to 100 in there. And Dan flops a straight. He okay. is Jack. What a dream flop because in a three bet pot, not only do you have the nuts, it's almost like somebody has to have something that can pay you. Dan goes with a pretty big size in here. And Ace Queen, that's a nice fold. Perceptive fold, it's it feels like a hand you're supposed to call. But it's a pretty big sizing in a three bet pot on a board where you can have lots and lots of better hands. Yeah, that's sick. I'm guessing you didn't sell any action, right? It's so small. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, not for an 1100. He won the, uh, like his casino's main event two years in a row. It's the Arizona State Championship. What are the taxes on that? Um, they give you the whole amount, and you just got to you got to pony up and figure it out at the end of the year. Yeah. Do you play poker full time? Mm, not really. So, kind of. I don't know. I still have it. Still kind of a hobby too. Yeah. I still have a full time job. I've made into part time job. Eight hundred. Side gig. It's easy when you win 250 a year. Yeah. <laughs> and I come here and dunk half of it back. Yeah, to give you it guys. back to us good I Californians. Play, this is like my fourth time playing here. And <laughs> I was 0 for 3. Race from Dan, okay, called by eight. Dylan. Yeah. Got me once last time I was on. Kings versus Aces, got it all in free flow. You're, you're, you're the only one Rampage has gotten. Yeah. The poor guy is yeah. running so bad. Your money is no, 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 first. Yeah, oh yeah, he gave it. He <laughs> can't beat you, Dan. I've heard, I've heard. Uh -huh. I can't beat you. I'm trying. Yeah. I'm trying my hardest. <laughs> Race from Nick, two calls. Check, check. Six on the. Flops the four, bets and wins it. So we have no control over the noise that people make on the floor. They're here on Friday night playing some poker. They're obviously having a good time. Didn't you say someone down there one would play? Oh, I was just, I was just kidding. Oh, you're kidding? He won't play. Dan with a real hand now. Thank you. I'm so sorry. There's the three bet. Mike, thirteen hundred. Seven off Leave the door is closed. You pulled that one, but the Jack Four you play? That was original. That was not original. Hearts 
Jack of Hearts, four uh, clubs. Oh, oh, Jack of Clubs, four of Hearts, buddy. Not even the original. Dust the three kit for nothing. Then you announced original, well, and it wasn't did. the original. You did announce original. It's called the robbery, Mike. I think it's called dumbery. <laughs> dumb, dumb. It's called donating. It's allowed. Yeah. 300. Right. Not 1, even 000. the original. I'm really disappointed. Should you should be. Free bit from Mariano. Jack We're six. On an island down there. I feel like I am. I, I don't even feel like a part of Nick the game. Dylan right? Nick in there. I want to go visit uh, three Dylan. Dylan over there. Yeah, thank you. <sighs> Check. Check. A pair of tens for air ball. Not a flop that anybody's too thrilled about in the three bet pot. Mariano fires at this. Nick calls. Uh, beer and tequila for me. Check. Interesting turn cards. Both players pick up flush draws, and it's going to be quite something if a club comes on the river in this three bet pot between these two hands. He's in line. Oh, these two. 5400. And another bet for Mariano and a call. Check, check. And Nick makes two pair. <laughs> and Mariano isn't going to love what he sees here, but what can he do? He's got jack six. like 10-7 Mike and call re -raises. I'm the solver. If I get a 10-7, I'll play. <laughs> Charlie going. Son and wife going, or just you? No, it's work trip, Yeah, I know, but we can still take them with you. I have a son, it's high school. Oh, yeah, what month is it? It's time spent. Right now, it's February. February, so there's still a school. I don't know what fucking month it is. Got her from Mariana. 2000. Who tried? Who tried? Uh, you have to send it to me. Yeah. I don't like India. I'm going for work with friends and partners that are Indian and yeah. our whole setup, so. It'll be fine. It's, um, it's usually a comfortable. Comf there you go. Yeah. Because they're just, you know. No, for sure. If you're on your own. In any country, you gotta figure it out, you gotta do this, you gotta, you know, when you have a friend or the family over there, just completely, completely different experience. Read that from Nick. So I'm told that Ryan is working the phones here, trying to get player two to replace Pepe and the other player who called off at the last second. Not sure when that will happen or who that will be. I'll call him when I take a break in a second. Serve. Pepe, <laughs> saving the game. Yeah. 
Three bet for Mariano and a call. Goes check, check on the flop. And a pretty nice card for Mariano to bluff here. Mariano can certainly have some strong hands here that we're planning to check raise the flop. He's not just capped to a single pair. Third club on the river and airball checks out a turn, which I don't think is any kind of angle. Mariano's got nothing. And if Airball had something decent here, I can't believe he would check out a turn like this. But he does call, nice call. Everyone keeps trying to make me fold third pair. <laughs> <laughs> he won't do it, folks. I just, I, just keep, I, I, I just keep refusing to fold third pair. Guys, stop. <laughs> I have third pair and I'm not going to fold it. Like, just because you know I have third pair doesn't mean I'm going to fold. <laughs> I thought it was going to work. I have third pair. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's a good one. Oh, yeah, it's fine. It was the out of turn check that did it. Sorry. Oh, yeah, yeah. They want you to. Mm. Right. Sorry, how was that? You know that was I, I know that was yeah. I was just like playing in flow, but I know. out of okay. flow. Yeah, definitely a this fold next time. genuine Call it a day. <laughs> mistake, not an angle. Just have it next time. Against you? Come on, dude. And then get paid. Three back from Nick, and Dylan wakes up with Queens. Okay, I wanted to punish you, but I let Dylan do that. Nick has played Easy money. quite well in a bunch of pots here tonight. A lot less than you. Um, uh, that's the unfortunate okay. thing. You want to add 100? Six, eight, ten. Eight, ten. Eight, Not this hand. Okay, cool. <laughs> Correctly folding like second pair. 11 something? Okay, thank you. To a single bet in the three bet pot, then calling down correctly right. twice Only with third like pair. You. But this decision to call really this three bet, given how little Dylan has behind, is yeah. not one of his better decisions. <laughs> the, way, the, way you're, the way you're playing right now, I'm not sure I'm, I'm excited about this. I mean, just don't try to bluff me. So a gutter for Nick, second pair for okay. Dylan. Nick does not bluff this time. And things are looking pretty good here for Queens, but how does Dylan want to proceed? Gets out of the way. No club. Son of a. Okay. 
That's the river? Two pair. Jack four. <laughs> the original. Club and heart. Mm. Have anything, Dylan? I had a pocket pair. <laughs> he cost me a lot of money. I hope it was Queens. It's a good guess. <laughs> Not the right guess, but a good guess. Yeah. So neither player flops much in this three bet pot. Dylan does not bluff. Even though he's just got 10 high. So Mike X is gonna stab. Had the best hand anyway, and wins it. From the big blind, Mariano with a real hand bumps it up. Oh, your, your buddies here this trip? Uh, yeah. Trying to be more active, you know? <laughs> Trying to get a workout. He is, and, and good for him. Fair. Dylan does not bluff. It's all diamond flop. He's going to go for a delayed stab on the turn. And an easy continue here for Mariano. And six here for Dylan, so this will probably go check, check. Since Dylan can beat some ace high now. Well, no, actually. Mariano is going to donk bet this, thinks that Dylan is going to be checking this back too frequently and that his hand is strong enough to seek some value. All right, I'll pay you off again. And he's right. Dylan, rivering a six. Puts in a bet that Mariano is able to collect. Tired of sitting down at a poker table filled with pros? 
Then come the WPT Global, the online home of the World Poker Tour. With a maximum of two pros at each table, everyone has a chance to win. We are leveling the playing field at WPT Global. Sign up today with this QR code or go to WPTGlobal.com slash hustler and use bonus code YT93 and we'll match your first deposit dollar for dollar. That's right, WPT Global will match your deposit with a first time bonus. Sign up for the welcome package at WPTGlobal.com using code YT93. Couldn't say enough good things about him. Whoa. Huh? Whoa, wow. So you like him almost as much as you like me. <clears throat> almost. Yeah. No deuce. Dan wins it pre flop with the big slick. No stand up. <laughs> you know you're weird in some ways. Really weird. Five. Five. I'm just trying to tell you, Mike. It's working. It's an exact. Is that six or five? Five. It's working? Yeah. Okay, start. Oh, you, you achieved. 100% I will not play today. So. <sighs> It's a raise from Steiner. Couple calls. <laughs> and Ryan Steiner flops a gutter. Queen Jack is still the best hand. <laughs> he still worked out. He's going to have a heart attack. The casino manager told him, and then next time this breaks, you're paying out of your own pocket. Oh, <laughs> oh they fixed it. I didn't even notice. Yeah. That's an expensive sliding door. Steiner okay. is able to take this down with a C bet. So 6,600 of you out there watching, we appreciate you all. If you're in the chat, let me know what you're up to this weekend. What are your plans for the weekend? Personally, are you next week then, Mike, at all? No. It's uh, getting ready to leave. Yeah, it's so much. Too much to do. Prep yeah. for. So this is your what? Farewell show. Exactly. For a month. I know you're gonna miss me, but it's okay. I'll I'll be in Please. touch. I'm going to some kind of goth concert with my girlfriend. She wants to go tomorrow. Was that complicated to call? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was. Uh, you must have had a big fucking hand. And then playing some. 10:20 in Sandor's yeah, game at Lucky Lady on fun. Sunday. Me too. You too. Darn it. 200. So two pair here for Mike X. Gets. <laughs> Nick like Airball like? to just call with a straight. <laughs> now I'm full. So you didn't like that one? Yeah. Is that what you expected to see or no? Yeah, <laughs> I was expecting to see like a, a seven of diamond yeah, yeah. or something like Not that. Not the five three off, no Not diamond? Not five three off. Yeah. Surprised me too. No, oh, that's a straight. It's, it's a natural. Not yeah, it is. Mm -hmm. Big fucking hand. Jimmy Favor says the son is coming home from college. Twenty-four, twenty-six. How many people are there? Saying they went to a Taylor Swift concert in Sydney. A couple people going to see the 
New movie about Bob Marley, One Love. Several people, actually. And in Florida, says fishing in the Atlantic. That sounds nice. So Mike X with the best of it here. And a brick on the river. Chicago says his daughter has a volleyball tourney in Indiana this weekend. Good luck to her. Race from Dan takes one down. Fridays are supposed to be like the big games. There's all the people. Oh, I don't know what's going on today. Interesting. You know, I think the truth is they announce you're showing up. Everybody gets scared to stay home. Me? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. the two time that Arizona champion. State champ. No one wants In to a play row. against the two time state champ. That makes sense. Super pro. <laughs> Super pro. Not even normal pro, right? Uh -uh. I lost that status this, after the second time. I mean, I almost canceled, but then I'm like. And you're like, fuck it, why yeah. not? I agree. Doesn't matter. I'd rather punt it to him than air ball. So. Yeah. Three bet from Dan. And I think Steiner could just pitch this. He does. So does Dylan. That's a good suited connector, but not incredibly deep. Nice raise. Nice raise. There you go. Yeah. Mariano bumps it up. Dan with a three bet. Easy, easy game. Easy game. Mike three bets. Dan calls. 
and flops the flush draw. So a bet from Mike and a call on the flop. Right, it was Mike who bet the flop. Now Dan's leading the turn. Interesting decision. Dan's sort of saying he has a six here, but I'm not sure he has one enough of the time to justify this. Does make his flush, though. And Mike, having made the call on the turn, suspecting that Dan's bet on the turn was full of baloney. Now in a rough spot here because front door diamonds have come in and Dan is continuing to bet. Dan hoping that Mike has an ace here, but he doesn't. So sevens feels like a pretty easy fold. But Mike is still sorting out what Dan is doing with this unconventional line. It's a good sizing to target an ace, but unfortunately for Dan, Mike doesn't have one. And Mike lets it go. Dan in there again. Mike wants to get some revenge, but he's going to have a hard time doing so on this flop. Dan checks back. Wants to do some bluffs. And he does. King eight, still good. does not continue firing. And Dan thinks his hand is best. Puts in a small value bet. This is a pretty cool value bet. I think it's so easy to just check back here. But Dan thinks he has the best hand. Also probably thinks that Mike could have something like Jack-10, Queen-Jack. And Mike makes the call with just a queen. So, cool little value bet from Dan gets paid off. But it's Nick Airball who tops the cumulative winnings courtesy of Odds Jam. Nick's up $38,000. Dan and Mike X both stuck around 11000 Everybody at the table a little bit stuck, in fact, except Nick. Did you choose a job that stays local on purpose, or is it just lucky? A little bit of luck. Okay. I, I wanted to stay out here if I could, but you don't always get to choose where you film. 
so you have to drive to and from set every day? Yeah, but it's back in my hometown, actually. Okay. In, like, Westlake, so. Where is it? Like, Westlake? Yeah, it's like 40 minutes away. Yeah. It's not so bad. Yeah. Steiner, Queens, this is an odd three bet sizing. Definitely want to go bigger than this out of position in almost every spot, but Steiner, tournament player, maybe using some tournament voodoo here. Might be trying to induce something behind. Mariano makes the call with 5-4 offsuit, that's interesting. There's an ace for Dylan. Shout out to Kevin LAX in the chat. Kevin has played the Monday and Thursday games several times recently. Dylan value bets this turn. Steiner calls with the Queens. And three spades out there now. Shouldn't stop Dylan from putting in a value bet here, I don't think. But he checks back. No, I didn't have any either in that hand. Yeah. Catch a type of hand, you know. Because I was losing to Ace, I was losing to Trips, I was losing to Flush. Yeah. Like there was. <laughs> so, I, I was beating basically. Uh, I missed everything. Mariano opens it up. Dylan with a free bet. Mariano calls. And pretty good board here for Dylan. And gets the better ace to fold. Hey, man. Just trying to take after you. I mean, I learned from watching you, okay? This is I watch the vlogs. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't play poker anywhere else. I need to watch There's the no vlogs. Okay. So, uh, Thanks for including me, by the way. Snipemare says you can't oh, value so bet with that last spade me. hitting, guys. Come on. So easy to comment from the TV. Yeah, I guess so, I but made one of your vlogs one if Steiner time. had spades, he probably yeah. would have bet the flop. Yeah. Was it a donation situation? or was Yeah, it? you were. You, uh, you had seven deuce soft suit. You can always value bet small I had, also. No, you lost. Oh, I had... Uh, he lost with seven deuce? I don't know, wow. Queen ten. So. Was king, king, ten. Turn was a ten. Oh, that's you, not like, good. Gave up. And like, <sighs> gave up on the river. Hoping you blast off again, but you didn't. Maybe from Dan with the queen five off. Out there? <laughs> Bottom two for Dylan, straight draw for Dan. <laughs> ten is, yeah. ten is huge. He's gonna come play Mike. Dan keeps betting.
And Dylan is going to raise. Now we see that Dylan's ahead. But Jack-10 is sneakily not that great a hand in a three-bet pot on this board. Can potentially get some value from hands like King-Queen, though. Two queens. And, of course, if Dan is three-betting hands like Queen-5 off, raising with Jack-10 becomes a lot better than if Dan has a more conventional range. And he gets Dan Damn. to fold the straight draw, which is definitely a pretty good outcome. <laughs> Joshua Levy says, what do you do when he check raises? Close your eyes and call? I, I worry about that when it happens. Yeah, I had to protect it. When that happens, I figure it out. It doesn't stop me from putting in a bet with what I think is the best hand. Mariano raises Mike X three bets and Mariano calls. And a nice board for Mariano. from Mike X, though. Sacco B says, they're playing five-handed, Charlie. Jack-10 is a good hand. You're probably right, actually. Yeah, good, good raise from Dylan. You're probably right. Especially since, as we discussed... Dan was three betting queen five off. He's got all kinds of weird hands there. Then you get to raise there quite a lot. So Mariano makes the six card straight. And puts Mike all in. Mike snaps it off. Mariano stacks Mike X. $4,500. Mariano doing Mariano things. That was a very Mariano thing. 5,000, you owe them 5,000. Keep those and just give them 5,000. Oh, okay. Here, Mike. 30, Mike? 30. So Nick Airball, still the big winner as we look at the cumulative winnings courtesy of Odds Jam. Mariano. Up 16K now, and Mike X stuck 35,000. Dan, action Dan, playing the most hands, 54% of hands played here tonight. <laughs> no, it was 35, right? So I didn't want to count to 
<laughs> Thought maybe I should change him to a big chick. Breeze from Dan. Mike calls. Steiner just calls. Good spot to squeeze, in my opinion, but calling is also fine. We'll go three ways to a flop. And Steiner's Jack outkicks Mike's. Mike already stuck 35K tonight. The hole might be getting a little bit deeper here. There's two pair for Steiner. Mike just drawing to a queen now. Three clubs out there. And I think Mike's, yeah, I mean, this is, is this for bluff? Is this for value? It's unclear. Not that it always needs to be totally clear on the turn, but I, I do feel like Mike is leading himself into a confusing place here. Long think. Steiner makes the call. Now four clubs out there, which could spare Mike from further trouble. Either because he'll check it back or because he'll be able to bluff Steiner off two pair. He goes for the check. Steiner wins a $7,800 pot. Doc says, this is an I don't want to get bluffed out on the river bet. Yeah, I, I thought so too maybe, but then it was kind of a big size for that. Usually when people bet for that reason, they bet pretty small. it up and nobody has a whole lot who, who did you say was coming Kia Key? Key. Key. Key and I don't know if Baba's coming I don't think so is Key, Key just a dude as well Key is just a dude yeah <laughs> nice yeah. dude PLO player he's cool He is just a dude until he removes his glasses and puts on his cape. Oh. 
Doc says, Charlie, when you play against someone as loose aggressive as Dan, what's your typical strategy? Flatting more and letting them blast into you or just relentlessly three-betting their light opens? I mean, I guess the answer to the latter question would depend on what you think they're going to do in response to those three bets. If they're just going to be calling them a lot, then three-betting very wide with a linear range seems really good. If they're going to be four-betting light, then maybe you're doing a little bit more flatting. And of course, your strategy is going to change a lot depending on whether you're in or out of position. But you do want to give them a lot of rope. So letting them barrel can be quite good. The air ball wins a small one with the overs in a gutter. When do you leave, Dan? Thursday. Oh, yeah, hopefully, I, I don't know if you guys are playing on Wednesday or. I need, I need one more. No, 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 he gets one. I only get one, yeah. I feel like I'm playing with one card against you. No, it's all good. Fair is fair. I was like, I, was like, I like the you? first one, but I need another one. Steiner collects the blinds. Any fun games? Hmm? Any fun games? I've been playing a lot of PLO lately. The Holden's been a little slow, so I've just been playing a lot of PLO. Ebbs and flows. What about you? Three. Yeah, I just mostly uh, hold them. Yeah. Um, supposed to check out a PLO game on Monday. Oh, I know which one you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. If you go that game, I'll, I'll come So three back from Dylan. Mariano makes the call. And an ace out there. Bet in the call. Another bet from Dylan. Mariano with outs to a jack or a nine. Doesn't find one. And Dylan checks back as a straight completes on the river. Lexo out on the floor tonight, playing 5 5 10. Another big ace for Dylan. And Dan, three bets the 7 4 suited. Mariano with the cold call. How much is it? 18. Dylan makes the call as well. Okay. And five, still the best hand. Hard to realize though. Five on the turn would be disgusting, but Mariano gets out of the way. And Dan's bluff gets through. 
didn't want to fold, but yeah. Are you gonna go to Vegas this summer? You know, I'm thinking about it. Yeah, yeah. play with a few tournaments, do that kind of thing. Yeah. What about you? Yeah, I'll be there probably all summer. All summer? Yeah. Do you get a place out there kind of thing, or what? What's no, your? No, I'll just stay at Aria. Stay at Aria. Yeah. I love the Aria. What are you? What are you playing? Cash or tournaments? Yeah. Okay. Maybe like one of the PLO events. No, definitely not the main. Jim O.B. gifting five chat memberships. Thank you. They have like a 50k PLO this year, I think. That's what, that's, I think we'll get a good turnout. Maybe I'll play that. Dylan, another strong preflop hand. Gets three bet by Mike X. No. So it was just like not already a chopping game, and now we're playing oh. a fucking tournament and we're chopping every pot. Like. I, don't, I don't play any of those games anyways, like PLO yeah. or that, but PLO There's some a four bet. seem to be pretty excited about it. Like for the first time having a double board bomb pot. Yeah. The bomb pot's are like, double bomb pot's I think pot. you can go a little bit smaller than this. One hand's like pairs smaller than queens to continue. And you've already got so much money in the pot once they call that it's not super scary to let them see a flop. Race from Mike, Dan calls. Jim Starr says, tell me the truth about Mark Goon. Mark is concentrating on building a business just called Hungry Horse Poker. Poker training and staking company. That I also do a little bit of work for. Mariano raises. Lucky. Dan three bets and takes it down. I wasted 300 bucks for nothing. There. That was just... uh. <laughs> Gotta watch out for aggro Dan over there with his pre flop raising. I don't know what I expect. <laughs> My, only chance. Yeah. My only chance is pre flop. <laughs> Mariano has noticed how aggressive Dan has been. the best of it here. Okay, 200. Show you the original. 200. Original. <laughs> Shots. 
<laughs> when Key gets here suited, he'll be in for shots. Yeah. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I was really excited to hear that Odds Jam was partnering with Hustler Casino Live because I have been using Odds Jam for the last six to 12 months. I didn't really know all that much about sports. I knew a lot about odds through my work with poker. So I decided to investigate a little bit more on sports gambling. And what I found was that because there are so many different sites and so many different bets, you actually need a tool that scrapes all of the odds in real time. They have tools and dashboards where they will literally tell you what to bet and how much to bet. It's been absolutely eye-opening. Like, I think it's on Netflix. So Odds Jam, it's a monthly fee. You got, you got me. Yeah. Monthly subscription service. It's not a sports book, but it helps you compare odds from different sports books to find discrepancies and <laughs> basically create situations where you win no matter what. And I'm not a big sports betting guy either, but if Bart says he was using this site before we were sponsored by them, yeah, it's probably a pretty good site. Bart's really smart about that kind of thing. <laughs> Top two for Mariano. Bad turn card for Nick Airball. Checked back by Mariano on the turn. Wants to induce something from Nick Airball here. Four large. And he does. Pace. It's a 2x pot over bet. Mariano was waiting for it. <laughs> SD says, you win no matter what, uh, Charlie, careful with the rhetoric. You're probably right. I mean. I'm not making any guarantees. I'm just saying that's the idea. I'm also saying I'm not a sports betting guy, but I do trust Bart. Straddle. Dylan with the hand that never loses. today, dude. I've been giving you money. What do you mean? I've, I've called you off with King High. I called yeah. you off with... I don't, I don't even remember what I called you off with when you had a nine. <laughs> it's like we're competing who plays worse today. I, <laughs> I mean, we're both doing a good job at it. <laughs> Not a competition you want to be in. Six for Nick Airball. Dude, they're freaking out over there. <laughs> um, 
at the uh, talking stick? Do they have like private rooms and stuff like that, or is it just one big room? One big room. Yeah. yeah. I dig that vibe. I like it. Yeah. I've played in like secluded rooms and stuff, and it feels kind of serious. No, it's legit. Like, I mean, big, as big as all these tables, but like, no, yeah. just one big room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All ceilings like this, and the tables are very spread out. They got the like, same table still, though. It's like no, bean. they got the bean shape like oh, on the shit, lodge. Really? They, the I'm same like, guy who made the it? tables for the lodge made oh, the tables we're talking about. So, yeah, I know. So they got all new tables too. Yeah, yeah. That's a big, they got some investment. I know. Too, oh, for sure. Yeah. Five hundred. Like it? It legit has to be one of the nicest, biggest rooms in the country. Yeah, for like, sure. It already was a pretty sick room. I'm really surprised that they want us to upgrade that. Like, it's so nice. Who was like, yeah, we need to fix that? I don't know, but they did. Yeah, no complaints there, right? Steiner repping State Kings, the New York Mets, and Talking Stick. Go. Let me see. And I think that turned it for a third time in the row this year. Dude, that would be so sick. They rename it to Steiner Invitational. <laughs> <laughs> King for both Dylan and Dan. Dan's actually going to raise. And Dylan not happy, but he's going to call it off, and they'll chop this up. Mondays often, Nick? No, no. No? No, okay. Yeah, I heard it's uh, more my vibe. Yeah. Yeah, nice. Ben, where are you living in? Sorry? Where are you living in? Toronto. Oh, yeah. yeah. Three on dough. Praise. One thousand. Bump it up, 45 hundo. Four bet from Dan. Never one to shy away from a good time pre-flop. What is Nick Airball thinking about facing a three bet and a four bet? Let's it go. Mariano is quite light. He folds as well. Three bets the Jacks. Ryan called Ethan, tried to get him here. I was thinking, why doesn't he come play? Steiner, coming along. Yeah, he's in Vegas, I think. Nine six. Oh, and Jack in the window. Oh, is he? Yeah. Nice. Pretty nice flop. Six hundred. Tiny bet. For Mike and Six will be happy to come along. Mm -hmm. 
Mike with the check mark now. Steiner gets out of the way. He's done some other things. Right? Um, he was here yesterday and he like said he was going to be on time. Um, so it's almost like mildly concerning. Yeah, it's kind of. Yeah. Well, he, was, he was here for the PLO or whatever? No, he came to get some cash, I think, or something. But he just was hanging out with me and uh, Ishan for a little bit. Yeah. Ryan came and like chatted with him. And, uh, he's probably just asleep. Yeah, I guess. I mean, I know he was probably out late last night. Three, 300. Can you call Tito, please? Louis, can you send Tito, please? Nick raises three calls. And a set of fours for Dylan. Two players with an ace. I feel like always Dylan has. Dylan, I feel like Dylan's flopped a lot of monster hands, whereas opponents have also flopped something. have me stuck in. Well, they have me stuck. Like, what, what am I down? Check, check. All right, kicking around. Yeah, 13-5. Dylan checks back the turn. What if your opponents have an ace? Definitely want to try to get some value there. Check, check. Too large. Probably only would have gotten two streets of value either way. But what if they've got a hand that can give you three? And now this line just does not look like a bluff. What are the bluffs supposed to be here? Nick does make the call. Keep him honest. Dylan wins a $6,800 pot. Dan raises, nobody has a whole lot. Thank you. Nice, so you said Ethan's gonna play the LA PC? Yeah, he's supposed to. Yeah, he's supposed to tomorrow, and he said that we can't stay out like this commerce thing. Yeah, I assume it's, the it's gotta be thing. it, yeah. He's all obsessed with those things. So. Oh, this is my my first time playing this okay. any yeah, event. 
300. I was wondering how, what types of players are going to be in it, if like big players are coming around or if it's going to be soft. Uh, I'm sure there's going to be a bunch of like, maybe both. So called big names. Yeah. yeah. Four ways. Race from Mike, three calls. Nick Airball has a five. five. Some gutters out there. One of those gutters bets and Nick Airball calls. Check, check on the turn and see if Mariano can find an eight. He does not. He's going to go for the delayed double barrel here. That's probably not the correct technical term for that. Check, bet, check, or bet, check, bet, excuse me. And <laughs> third part. Mariano I knew you had third does part. get called <laughs> by <laughs> Nick's five. You, People keep trying to bet to bluff Nick <laughs> off <laughs> pairs. It's not going to work. Gonna Little did you know. I'm gonna pull my third pairs. <laughs> third pairs are hard to get. <laughs> Especially when they turn, when they become two pair. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I thought Mariano pretty credibly repped something better than a five there, but what do I know? Shadow's on. Moral victory because you didn't start. He did think for about. Eight seconds. I feel so. fine with it as long as it's not quick, you know? Yeah. He didn't completely school. I think in his head he knows he's going to snap call, but he wants me to keep doing it. Uh, yeah. 16. 16, Hundo. Simon, you're playing uh, 10K, right? 2-4. Uh, 10. Two, four. Ten. Finish. Race from Mike, three bet from Steiner, and Dan, the real hand, puts in the four bet. It's been so aggressive so far tonight. players suspect that Dan is pretty out of line, but he kind of has it here. And I don't think, even if he didn't, that he would be folding very often if Siner were to shove here. coming. Steiner, maybe Austin, also. Oh, he's shoving. All in and a, uh, call. And a snap call. Maybe like, yeah. Two times. I'm gambling. So I'm Steiner, five bet jams, the Jack-10 suited. That's about as good as and I like could I said, like I, 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 I don't think that was getting many folds. Could have had 10 back. Yeah. So you say? Given how little eight, Steiner had behind. Eight, oh, my spades. Eight, spades. Yeah, yeah, but his ace. Oh, that's, that's fair. fair. That's fair. That is fair. That is fair. Nothing there for Steiner. Well, two spades now. Okay. Too many outs. Too Doesn't many find one. Yeah. 
<laughs> they'll run this again. Runner, runner, baby. Now the seven. Oh, come on. Okay. Too many a straight draw for Steiner. Like a seven of diamonds. A ten six. Seven is blocked. Queen is blocked. Jesus <laughs> More outs for Steiner. Has almost half the deck here. If I miss this, I gotta, I gotta take a break. Two, two boards in a row, just too many outs. He does with Dan. Stack Steiner. Holds on. Steiner turns a ton of outs on the second run out. Free flop warrior. Yeah, right. Like, <laughs> post flop, no idea. <laughs> Ryan's panicking upstairs. <laughs> Tell him to come down and play. We need some juice. Can you come down to play? What do you say? Tell him stop being a pussy. Tell him he needs to come donate more money to me. Thumbs are low. Ryan's about to go offer to stake some 510 players to come play. <laughs> you see him down there, you're like, I'll take 80% of you. <laughs> Just go play, please. Free scallops and shrimp. <laughs> He's desperate for really, yeah. He's like, I'll do anything. Just play. Louis about to sit down with him. Yeah, Louis about to jump in. The game's good, Louis. <laughs> it's the open. Too small for Louis. Take the slurp sound for Louis. It's too small for Louis. Mariano raises. Mike X calls. And a 10 for Mariano. Ha-ha is of over 200 bucks, right? Sorry, Mike, not all of us are rich like you where we don't Trips for Mariano money. now. No, Boat, some people actually. Can have so yeah. much I mean, fun. Dylan care a lot. Yeah. About two hours, two hours two guys. Hours. Mike does not have a whole lot, though. I'm about to get up and walk out. <laughs> I'm up 10, I'm like, all right. <laughs> Mike X out of the way. One of these days. Race from Dan. Mariano defends. I'm super tilted with you on Tuesday. And a 10 for Dan. Yeah. I wasn't going to play on Tuesday. That's why. You won. I know. I wanted to be a player. I was going to play with you. See, I could play only two days. It was too much. It was either Tuesday, Wednesday, or Wednesday, Friday. Wednesday, Friday. And then, uh... Hmm. You know, it's interesting. I, I saw probably three quarters of it. I was doing what? a bunch of stuff in the computer. And of what? Uh, uh, Tuesday yeah, night game. Oh, yeah. And, uh... 
1100. Best of my recollection, Luda was behaving. He was not, you know, sometimes he goes in this nut gear where he just. You got me, man. I was three bed, four bed, kind of nonsense. Yeah, three beds, hands like 10 9 off suit. I think you had something. Exactly. The sheriff was in town. That's what I'm saying. You had something to do with it, right? <laughs> He knew that there was no fucking, not too much fucking around allowed. <laughs> and he was having too much fun. Also, he was like winning most of the sessions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I hate was that. Winning. Everything was just smooth for the, for the chaotic crowd. I was on the verge of chaos, but then I got unstuck. Oh, you started, right? You started dusting, right? No, yeah. not dusting. Okay, Dustin. I don't remember what, <laughs> what happened. Dustin. I don't know if he got cooler or if he just... Oh, just Dustin. Limped pot here and okay. Dylan's deuces counterfeited. Okay. We're going to chop this up if it checks back here. It does. Okay. Split that one. The original. Not Almost. the original. Almost. Yeah. Is this the original Jack of Space Four Hearts? Opposite club. Though, right? Club Hearts. Yeah. Right? Club Jack Clubs Four Hearts. Because yeah. the Jack of Clubs is the blocker. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. You have to have the blocker, buddy. Yeah. This guy leave, he left some thing here. No, he'll be back. Yeah, he just take a walk. Walk off that 10k oh, loss. Magic, can you break these? Hey, he's a two time Arizona State champion, so. <laughs> Put some respect on his name. I understand. 500? I might walk off the fucking $200 I lose from the big one. <laughs> Fucking feel you. Group walk, Dylan? Yeah, definitely. I need to get my steps in anyway. I mean, you just lost $50. Yeah, yeah I'm... <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> uh, oh, someone's going to be walking after this hand. <laughs> <laughs> nice little stroll. Three bit from Dan and a couple calls. Three ways. Who's gonna walk it off? And the deuce is the best hand here. Thousand. Oh. Mike. Makes the call with just a science and backdoors. And Mariano comes along as well. And nice turn for Mariano. Picks up a ton of outs and with position here should be able to win this pot given how weak his opponent's hands are. for Mariano and I, I don't really see how Dan or Mike can stick around here. Yeah. 
It would, it would actually be pretty incredible if either of them could fi find a way to win this hand. Bump it up. Wow, and Dan's going to try. 20 large. Make it 20,000. Check raises the turn. This is pretty sick. Blocks pocket deuces, blocks king 10 suited. The problem is that even if you completely discount those two hands, there are just so many strong hands Mariano could have. Hard to know that Mariano has 10 three of spades here. And now he's gonna have to continue a bunch of outs. And on the river, and Dan makes a straight. <laughs> I bet he was hardly even thinking about that happening. Kind of a free roll for him, too, because Mariano just isn't really going to have ace king in this situation based on the pre flop action. you want to set this up here can certainly play for all of it but it's not like you can just move all in and expect to get called widely by hands worse than a king he's going to try anyway though he shoves Mariano quickly out of the way so that was fun what a hand by Dan thank you Cedar just as I said, it was going to be really hard for him to find a way to win the hand. He absolutely did it. And it started with his raise on the turn. What's up, Super? How are you, buddy? It's a bird. It's a plane. You want to take my money again? Yeah, right. It's suited Superman. I'll wait. I'll wait one hand. Here to save Lusser Casino Live. Suited man. Suited man. That was so yeah. funny. Chris. Uh, yeah, I'll take a. Um, oh, sorry, three. I thought it was travel. I'll take a. Uh, uh, yeah. Diet Coke with ice. Suited, suited man. Make it 1200. Rockets for Dylan. Nice small. Are you back today? Uh, today? After you're gonna play? Maybe, yeah. Let's do it. Don't say let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> We've been getting murdered every day. That, that seems impossible. I want to see that. Huh? I want to see that. He had like a pair and a flush draw, two pair or something. Based on his river fold speed. And he had something. <laughs> That's my analysis. Mariano gets out of the way. I, 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 I was, I was yeah. squeezing, like I had definitely a squeezing hand. Yeah. You squeezed yourself into uh, to oblivion? Yeah. I yeah. wish you had, man. You would have saved me money. It's not your fault I can't get value. <laughs> he said, who knows? No, <laughs> you would have saved him money for sure. It's no, not who knows. <laughs> <laughs> he knows. He would have folded. Well, I'm not guessing. Like, <laughs> we know. It's, it's not who knows. Yeah. 20 suited? Suited Superman on Twitter and Instagram. Suited, suited, suited How are you doing, Keith? Uh, I'm a little sleepy like Nick, you know. Okay. We're, we're, playing, uh, we're playing PLO all night. Yeah. <laughs> 500. 500 to go. Suited with a really good Instagram it was account. Fun. It was fun, it was Yeah. It's fun. I'm, I'm sorry, man. I'm, I'm sitting here three hours. Wow, that's a lot of respect, Mike. Cool. Oh, sorry. Just flipped over. Thank you, Mike. <laughs> Five, <laughs> <in> the original. <laughs> and suited picks up Queens, his very first hand. Get some action from Mariano. Check. 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 
And Sudud is going to play some pot control here. That for Mariano, call. And Mariano's got a value bet small here with his nine. Gets snapped off by Pocket nice. Queens. That's a good start. Ladies. <laughs> I'm going to take a two minute break. I'll be right back. Cooler today. He yeah. beat Lauren in a 15k pot, lucky lady, in the 2 3 game. Aces versus Kings. <laughs> so Lauren doesn't like him anymore. <laughs> Lauren's like, let's see what these hands can do today. <laughs> what was the flop? Or was it pre flop? And now she's got a deal with him. There was like most, yeah. a lot of money pre flop and Jack 5 3 or 7 5 3 or some yeah, dusty yeah. flop and so everyone's all piece. in and Lauren's <laughs> dead up. <laughs> yeah. We ran, we ran three times. I uh, still have no okay. Modelo. Oh, actually, four times. No king. Okay. No <laughs> <laughs> you, guys ran. you guys were looking for the king. Yeah. You could really run it forward. We went four times. So yeah, it's a, it's a, you know, probably. I've seen, yeah, a lot of, in like, uh, when we played big KLO in Vegas, yeah. like, the really big pots, like, million dollar pots always yeah. get run, almost always get run four times. Really? I didn't know that. Yeah, just. You would just assume like, you know, two or yeah. like three, yeah. three max. You know, really big game, like sucks to get Six. scooped, like getting quartered doesn't hurt as bad, like for sure. Like if, if you're playing a million dollar pot you get quartered, like you lose 250 versus losing right. 500. Like, right. Feels you'll, take, you'll take that in yeah. the week. Yeah. And then the person who wins is still obviously feels good. Yeah. You'll take 750. Yeah. <laughs> but it's painful to get scooped more time. Can't imagine. Like, I've seen the, like, one guy's behind, they get it in, and the guy behind goes, that's me, that's me, that's me, that's me. <laughs> no way. Yeah. Like, you know, like I that's said, the other guy's a rap plus like, that's me, that's me. <laughs> it's like taking a bad beat four times in a row. Exactly, it's super painful. I saw a hand where these, these guys got in three ways, and one guy wanted to run it twice, the other two wanted to run it four times. So the guy who ran it twice, he had... He was up against basically two outs against both their hands. Yeah. First board, boom. Second board, boom. No way. So he gets scooped for the main. And then they run it four times. And the guy on the, between the two of them who was a favorite. 5200. Uh, he was not the guy who had either of the first two boards. Third board, not him either. And then the fourth board, he managed to get like a quarter of the pot. <laughs> it's like crazy shit out yeah. Luckily, he quartered it. But like the guy who ran it twice in the main, he would have got half the pot. And he just ran it four times because he, the other only had two outs and he just hit them both times. So it's like really like tilting shit happens. Like, like super tilting shit. Alright, Lauren's here. Thank you, everyone. Alright. I went downstairs, told the 5'5'10 five, five, players they're being way uh, too loud. Give you aces. <laughs> arch, arch, never. Such a beautiful Friday. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That was All right, me. I'll take the chips, Lauren. <laughs> when I first started playing here, I been to this. On the floor, yeah. I mean, like blindfolded. All right. I don't know why. Yeah. Time, is, and they come back yeah. Time. What's the what, what are the buy-in? Mm-hmm. Uh, ten twenty four. Like, and then when Nick exactly. comes by, it somehow gets picked up to twenty forty somehow, eighty yeah. one sixty. Yeah. Every hand. So. <laughs> yeah. Wow. On Monday. When do you, when got you Max Payne Monday. Rampage will be in the house. Yeah, it's been going. Along with a bunch of your favorites, 10, 20, 40, and a contest winner. And you can be part of Max Payne Monday if you come down to Hustler and you're in a seat on Monday afternoon. There will be a random drawing, and the player will be staked $5,000 to play on Max Payne Monday. So get on down here to Hustler on Monday. 
It's going to be a great time. I was really excited. I was really excited. So, double gutter here for Dan. Top pair for Nick. Steiner. Steiner, nice to meet you. Dan doesn't get there. Pair of tens, no good here. The okay. airball checks it back There's and wins the small one. Find the queen. No queen, Lauren. Good job. No queen. Whose birthday? Thanks. This cheesecake. No thank you. Thousand dollar cheesecake. It's your birthday week. <laughs> Mike X, we'll be drinking so much water afterwards. Yeah. Thank you. So we'll get an updated look at our cumulative winnings courtesy of Odds Jam. Nick Airball up $40,000. Dan now up $28,000 and playing like a boss. On the other end, Mike X down $45,000. Steiner down twenty k. Because it looks like it's growing. It's great. Yeah, it used to be like... You know, a couple times a week, and now well, now it's daily, and sometimes we have two, three games a, day, a night. So that's it's awesome. just, yeah, that's great. It's more fun, more gamble, you know. Someone touched my tips. Oh, I lost collection. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> he loves it when I'm I come. Holding every hand. When dust. <laughs> I just come and I dust the fucking 20,000, 30,000, 40,000 in keys game. Uh, okay, you just take my money on stream and then, you know, bring it to my game. I run so bad in your fucking game, Key. <laughs> at least you're buying like 2K at a time, not like 10K at a time. I'd be broke. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be fucking broke. What do you want from me? I mean, 2K at a time, you guys are going to break me too. Fuck. I still can't believe that fucking pot I lost to Andrew. I mean, what the fuck? Yeah, that was insane. Nick and Superman talking about the big PLO game running I'm regularly now here at Hustle. Today, huh, buddy? I'm in a deserty mood, dude. I don't know what's going on. It's frozen, huh? It's yours frozen? Is it frozen? Oh, yeah. What's up, Nick? You don't indulge? We got that weight loss bet with Ryan. Oh, what? I don't know about that. Yeah, yeah. We got to lose some weight. Is it a one-way bet? No, no. Like, three of us. Mm. We all have to do it. Who is it? The third person's a guy named Jeff. Okay. He, he doesn't play on stream or anything. Okay. Just like a friend of ours. What's the bet? We have until June 8th. We each have to lose 20% of our body fat. Uh, if you don't do it, you pay 50k to the guys who do, and then whoever is least successful pays 50K to the most successful. So like 100K max loss. Damn, that's a good amount. Yeah. Enough to care? Enough to care. I guess that's the point, right? Yeah, that's exactly the point. I, I wanted it more, and some, some of them wanted it less, but we had to make it find a number that everyone agreed. So Dylan flops top pair in this three bet pot. Nothing there for suited Superman. King Jack. Good. And Dylan checks back. <clears throat> Collects a $7,200 pot. <laughs> oh, 
Three to what? 250 to post or 300 live in front of you. Yeah. 300 to shuttle. I see him flying shuttle in front of you. It's hard to look at two cards after looking at four all night. Because you have no idea how you do that. It's hard. That's why I didn't want to play on Wednesday because I was just like, when he came down, it's because I was like, I can't go from playing four to two. Yeah. It's like super hard to do. So a three hundred dollar straddle from Dan. Yeah, pretty boring. He just calls. Yeah, Ace ten suited. It. It's probably good that you stayed on there. Mixing it up. Pretty gross flop for both hands, but Dan's gonna continue facing a tiny bet. Superman picks up an open ender. Try to get there, but it's Dan who hits a pair. No real reason to think Ace 10 isn't good here, so Dan's going to bet. Another playable hand for Suited. Steiner defense. And an open ender for Steiner. He's got seven high. Time to bluff. Superman hanging on here. Steiner's got one of the worst hands you'd ever turn up with. Superman with a king of spades here. Probably isn't thinking about calling. Yeah, he's going to jam. Had the best hand anyway, but using that king of spades as a bully card. And he'll take this one down. What time does your games really start? Um, usually like 2 to 4 p.m. The first oh, nice. game start, and sometimes we get a second game like around 7 to 8. Sick. Yeah. You guys want to do a round of show? Sure. Yeah, sure, you know, like sure. Every, every, every day you guys basically play? Yeah, it's been the last three months been every day. Sweet. We w I started this with another host like since um, a year ago. Okay. And it was like a couple times a week and we ramped it up. It's cool. It's kind of like a come all over. Like there's some guy driving from San Diego here just to play. Which is like a two hour drive, isn't it? Yeah, like an hour and a half, two hour drive. That's, that's how good the games are. You think. And what is like average Brian? Um, is there a max like, plan? Uh, five, uh, ten k cap for ten nice. for the game. Sweet. Yeah. I, I don't play any P at all at all. It gets so. big. I mean, like yeah. yesterday we switched to the twenty forty eighty. The one sixty was on like every hand, and like everyone had like twenty k except for me and Key were just dusted yeah. every hand. Yeah. Someone won like fifty five k yesterday. Who? <laughs> <laughs> the story checks out. Finally, we found Andrew's Krypton, Kryptonite. I mean, he should have lost a ton the other day. He fucking... Round the shuttle. Yeah. I like that Andrew, though. 
Yeah. Oh, he's here. He just walked in. <laughs> Give him a seat. <laughs> He played the stream once. Oh, at the, yeah. at the bike? No, here, here, here. Oh, here. He said he got his worst bad beat ever. It was, he said it was an ace, queen, whatever board. They get it on the turn. He's up against ace, king, and it comes king on the first one, king on the second one. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty funny. No, it's like an ace, queen, whatever, small board. He gets it in with ace, queen against ace, king, and it comes king, river, king, river. <laughs> pretty sure it was against Henry. Yeah, that's what he said. Yeah. Okay. Hey. Superman takes it down with the pocket fours. Definitely don't mind just winning there on a flop like that. Ryan runs like dog shit on this show too, right? Like I'm not imagining it. Like, like the. <laughs> Ryan likes to make high life. <laughs> oh, but he, I think he, he plays his clip. Like, you get some stuff in these spots that are just nuts. I think he plays perfect on the show. <laughs> <laughs> Especially when uh, in, into your nut flush. Yeah, that yeah. one was hilarious. No, 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 straight flush. Straight flush. <laughs> straight flush. <laughs> oh, that was fun. Yeah, that was really fucking hilarious. You want to tap the glass? That hand was awesome. That hand was so, much so fun. good. He should come show us right now. Yeah, <laughs> there is a scene. That hand was some of my favorite hands I ever, I ever got to play. It was very enjoyable. The moment the flop came out, the hand was just enjoyable. <laughs> there was zero stress about any run out. Yeah, yeah. Just like, just put whatever, he, give him whatever he wants. Like, anything he wants, give it to him. So, Dan, with the Cowboys here and this is such a great spot for him because he's been so aggressive all night. And Mariano's got a real hand. No respect these fuckers. You and your dust. You and your dust started a war. No respect. Wow, Mariano folds. Nice fold by Mariano. I, I, I'm kind of surprised he didn't continue, to be honest. But he folds and he's right. Was it the eye contact? Was it the eye contact right now? Yeah, that's a. I'm big. I'm sure. Woke up with something, Dan? Definitely woke up with something, yeah. Yeah. It's a nice feeling for the big Kings. Kings. Yeah. It's a nice feeling. <laughs> but if Mariano jammed, it would have been a tough spot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> exactly right. <laughs> would have had to walk it off. <laughs> so raise from Mike X. Mariano and Dylan in there. What time do you guys break that game? Pretty nice flop for nines. And they dusted you on the app, huh? I saw it. Saw it. So, DMP number one. You still won? I thought you were going to have all the money on the app. Yeah, that was, we had a stack. That was the pot. Do you also do a uh, PLO online? Uh, I just play it. Checks around to Mariano. And Nine. no reason for Mariano Nine. to bluff. And Dylan's going to take it down. Thank you. 
prefer no limit or zero? Yeah, I prefer no limit just to like. Oh, sir? No limit for the most hard, but yeah. I really do enjoy yeah. playing Jill. Yeah. yeah, of course. Yeah. Do you, you want any? Oh, yeah, sorry. Round of straddle. Practice. Artist. I'm up to like 80,000 losing hands yesterday. <laughs> Steiner opens from a pretty short stock. Mike calls. I'm playing PLO and I'm getting and these guys to the end. And these guys have two outs. Like literally two outs in PLO. I'm so dead. And every time they hit. Every fucking time. I had one guy dead in the fucking 40k pot in that game. He's dead to two. Yeah, two backdoor flush draws. All he has. He's nothing else. Just two backdoor flush draws. Of course, he's good. You win. Nuts. This other guy, I have a higher pair in the nut flush draw. He's just an under pair with the worst flush draw. Set. Whatever. River. Boom. No problem. And does Steiner want to continue here? He lets it go. That must have been a fun day. Yeah. Not your game, Keith? I was igniting it. Pretty funny, designed right? Designed to designed to torture Evo. You know? Yeah. The torture, torturing, torturing chamber. So set it up for today, you know. <laughs> if you tilt today, you guys are welcome. <laughs> I only run it once in that game, no matter what. And they like some of the guys will beg me to run it twice. I'm just like no once. And then yeah. every time I lose, <laughs> every fucking time. You didn't tilt him enough. He hasn't punted today. Yeah, not yet. You didn't, you didn't do enough work. He's just calling it third and fourth pair. Yeah, he's just he's just like calling, but nothing hey. crazy. Okay. At least you run like that in small game. You know? Yeah. That's Maybe you save all the good run in like bigger games. Two, four. Maybe. Then the last hand tonight, I have Jack 10, 9, 8 with a flush draw. Off a Jack in the flush draw, get it in, right? Turn a flush, and the, or the board pairs in the turn, I'm like, fuck me. It's like, yeah, they Remember, I made a flush. He's like, oh, that's you. I turned my hand over. He's like, oh, wait. And his side card's made a full house. And he's like, 8, 6, 7, 4, and he comes like, Jack 4, 3, 4, 7, with the 7, making me the flush. Oh, sorry, full house. I was like, are you fucking kidding me? I'm running. Like, you can't read the guys who cannot read his own hand. <laughs> yeah, I was like, you guys don't even know what he has. You really don't know what he has, and you can't win. He just thought he was a scrack. Read that from Dan. <laughs> He's just like aces. Like, Pops a nine. Oh, full house. I'm like, oh, right. Okay, my bad. No, it's, yeah. How dare I even consider my flush might be good. <laughs> and why do I feel like Dan's going to find a way to win this hand somehow? He turns a flush draw. Does have some showdown value, though. And does not improve. Dylan gets his jacks to showdown. Steiner had ace nine of spades, would have flopped the top two pair. Jiggities. Jiggies. I don't know how to play Jiggies. Mm. He would have gotten the money in bad. I don't know. But he would have won. I definitely don't know how. <laughs> Swap a set and so can. Yeah, that's the only <laughs> time I feel good with Jiggies, to be honest. Wait. I thought I felt good Did until I ran just bigger set. Yeah. yeah, for sure. Of course, ace nine flop on Yeah. yeah. Totally yeah. standard yeah. fold. Ace nine suited like, oh, yeah. in that spot. Yeah. Yeah. Even, King's even against somebody as aggressive as Dan. Yeah. Yep. If you're going to play the ace nine suited, like, you're really saying that Dan is just it. that incredibly out of line. Yeah. Which maybe he is, just but it's a, quite a reach. Oh, you're the Lauren. <laughs> As you see, Mariano adding on $50,000. Oh, you said Kings? I yeah. missed that. I mean, it was that. only $15,000. <laughs> no big deal, right? 18000 18, My bad. <laughs> That's a big pot. Oh, no. No big deal for Lauren. She's rich. She didn't want that 18,000. She wanted Key to have it. 1,500 to go. Key won the pot where I was like, yes! Mariano in the $400 straddle. 
said Kings. We're playing again this weekend. No, we're not. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't play. I didn't want to see that. Heads up. <laughs> In a way. <laughs> Yeah, it's going to continue here. Okay. Does not bet on the turn when it gets checked over. Dylan makes a full house on the river. And unfortunately for him, Dan's not going to be able to pay him off unless he can find some very creative, aggressive way to do so. He lets it go quickly. Destroyed me last stream. I can't relax, he man. Me. I'm too uptight. Oh, he took What's like. Going on today? I think that's probably the only stream I watch. <laughs> it makes me feel a lot better now. <laughs> Next one. Easy to get back from the eye. Thank God the the hands off stream were in stream because that's the most important. Well, what did you have, Ed? It's not my day, that's all. I was so dry. The, 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 the ace king, I know. It's not always my ace king. When, yeah, when you had ace king and you, call, you snap yeah. called me on the radio. There he goes again. Then, there he goes the again. Um, like there was like a one card straight and the ace, ace on the river. And they just. Race from Dylan, free bet from Dan. Seven deuce got there. We were playing seven deuce. Uh, Mike cold calls. And let's see another raise. Dan has three bet a ton tonight. No one does four bet. Dan gets out of the way, and Mike is going to be forced to fold as well. I think I have to fold and, and run away because. Oh, we have Ace Jack. I think I was criticizing Dylan the other day for playing Ace-King a little bit too passively, but he gets it right there. King of Diamonds. That's a good one to show. King Eight of Diamonds. King Eight of Diamonds? <laughs> I don't know if I'm for betting King Eight of Diamonds. Maybe, maybe. I've maybe. seen you do it before. It's fun. Maybe one time. Mariano, do you do your own ending? No, not anymore. Oh, okay. It's a lot of work. Mariano raises.
Dan three bets. I feel like if I just made a recording of myself saying Dan three bets, I could save myself a lot of energy. So much fun. Caught you off guard, it's asking you about editing. And just 28 to the face. It's relentless. You just press a button on the board that says Dan three bets. It's not fun when you lose. Tell me. It is a lot funnier when you're winning. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm still having fun. Steiner, the pre flop raiser. <laughs> best hand on the turn. Already was the best hand, but makes a hand that he can what is he saying over there? I'm not continue sure. to put money like, in I with. I can only catch like every other word. It's like, like inaudible almost. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you just know it's funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I can just tell. Yeah. <laughs> Does check down though. Wouldn't mind seeing a bet there from Dan on the river. Pepe had a hangover or something? I don't know, dude. No <laughs> call, no show. He was here yesterday. I don't know what happened. Have to talk to HR. He was going to a party <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Reported to HR. Press the button. Dan three bets. Superman calls. Dan actually has the best hand here. Dan picking away at these small pots. I wish you luck and pocket kings, Mr. X. 200. This guy has hearing problems, right? Like, he <laughs> I'm starting to get the hang of it, Mike, I think. Go ahead, go ahead. I'll check it. <laughs> So Mike picks up some equity here after defending his big blind. No Dylan pocket kings. just goes ahead and folds. Stop a set like that, huh? That well, easy. Add on. Nice hand, Thanks, baby. That easy. So don't forget, if you want to play on the show, against Mariana, come on. We're going to be staking uh -huh. someone for yeah, $5,000 exactly. to play on Max Payne Monday, so be here on Monday, and if you're... I'm the 
easy pick. Seated. Going to be picking All right. a Six table seven. and a seat. And a player will get to play on Max Pay Monday on a $5,000 stake. Last time that happened, the player who won the stake also won on the stream. So it's a pretty awesome chance to right. be a part of Hustler Casino Live. without wrecking yourself financially. Well, that's a flop. Bottom two for Mike X. Huge draw for Superman. Basically a flip. Superman raises. And gets immediate service. The flush on the turn. Mike's going to know that's an awful card for him. Three thousand from Superman. Call. Mike makes the call. Try to find five or a four here. Size bet from Superman, and I don't think oh. five four can really continue here. This is a fold, but I'm too tilted to fold. But he's not going to. No flush. Snaps it off, and Superman wins a thirty thousand dollar pot. <laughs> too tilted to fold. Yeah, I am. You said it. Big sizing there on the river, and Mike just didn't want to let it go. I mean, I think Mike's got lots of two pairs and sets there, and the question really is what how, what size does Superman think those hands will call? He thinks that answer was 10,000 into 10,000, and he does get called. How much here? Adding 30. So Mike X adding on. Uh, 28. Squeeze for Mariano. Liner is going to have to get out of the way, I would imagine. No, I feel like an asshole. <laughs> so, cumulative winnings, courtesy of Odds Jam, Nick Airball up 39,000, Dan up 34,000, playing really well. Dylan, super suited Superman, also in the positive. Mike X stuck 62,000. Mariano and Steiner down as well. Bye. 
So Dylan raises, Dan calls and flops the middle set. Dylan pretty snug in spots like this and he lets it go. Correctly so this time. Just a call. I was about to press the button, but no. Trip six is for Mariano. Dan won't get in any further trouble. They are. <laughs> They're freaking out over there. Shout out to DJF in the chat. It's a limit game, right? <laughs> I don't know. Dude, so, I want to play that game. Tell them yeah, tell we got a seat open. Yeah, yeah, limit home games on this. It's straddle for five. <laughs> it's a 5,100 limit game in the foreground there that's causing the problem. The outer tables are not mic'd. They're just that loud. Bets. Suited calls. Checks to the river and Suited gets there. Does Dan think his ace high is good enough to call here? No, he lets it go. <laughs> I tried to be positive, you know. I, yeah. I was like, he did it, he doubled up. So I donated. Yeah. You yeah. donated? Seven, 15, 17. Oh, yeah. Key. Oh, so no add on. No, no, no. no I add did on. add on and win a little. And three bets. His 93rd three bet of the evening. 
Other players have to be getting pretty sick of this. There's a cold four bet from Mike X. Putting his foot down. And Dan lets it go. I don't know how was the uh, Texas trip. Oh, guys, was cool. so much, yeah, I watched the vlog. I'm like, wow, what a what a Tesla show! You oh man, <laughs> Thank you. he's the MVP, man. He made us all look bad. Yeah. I think that was his hand, right? The nine seven. That was a nine seven. Yeah, he played it a little different than you, but that was the same hand. <laughs> yeah. You <laughs> You're like, you couldn't believe it. I was really excited to hear that Odds Jam was partnering with Hustler Casino Live because I have been using Odds Jam for the last six to 12 months. I didn't really know all that much about sports. I knew a lot about odds through my work with poker. So I decided to investigate a little bit more on sports gambling. And what I found was that because there are so many different sites and so many different bets, you actually need a tool that scrapes all of the odds in real time. They have tools and dashboards where they will literally tell you what to bet and how much to bet. It's been absolutely eye-opening. Oz Jam's arbitrage tool allows you to cash in on risk-free profits by identifying inefficiencies in the market where you can bet both sides of the game and secure a profit regardless of the outcome of that game. It's like being in a poker session, knowing you're going to win every hand. I won't know. So you can investigate that further, clicking the link at the top of the chat. Mariano three bets gets two calls. Checks over to Superman. Checks it back. And big turn card for Mariano, but a hard spot to bet. Given just how many hands can be pretty happy on this board. Mariano improves here. Checks it over. Maybe hoping somebody else represents the ace here. Ace, ace, ace ball. Ace is good.
Nick Arabal looking a lot more awake than he was in the first hour of the show. Suited, suited man. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Double suited, suited man. <laughs> I, I don't play Dr. H is the funniest, dude. Oh, sorry. He's like, he came in and he was just like, suited, suited man, <laughs> good to see you. And he was just like, he was just so confident about it and his accent, I mean, it was just so funny. <laughs> and then he was like, I, only, I guess I only play suited cards or something. Yeah. Like <laughs> so Mike X, three back. Suited, suited man calls. Okay. Little flickers of equity for both players here. Picks up a gutter. Heading here to protect. Sean doesn't want to play today, Nick? Play what? Here? Yeah. How do you want to play this week? He, he, he's playing online today. It's, uh, I'm straddle, right? Yeah. Straddle. I often have that surgery, so I think. What's that? Uh, Eight. from Dan. This is a hand that probably looks like pocket sixes does to me. To him. Mike X gets out of the way. Dragon? Yeah, for back for our players, you go crazy. Three hundred. It's one thousand. Wow. Mariana, three bets. Nick calls. And a pretty nice flop for Mariano. Mm -hmm. 
Not much there for Nick. Gets out of the way. It's, it's insane. Like, they're, are they like just? It's not even just like the, so like the VIPs eater, are obviously very big, but like the whole culture is just, they're very superstitious and so they're around. Um, are they just like gathering around? The yeah, of course, but like, like they had like this massive mechanical dragon that would come down from the, from the, from the ceiling and like sh shoot out just like um, fog. When so someone like 20 minutes. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's wild. It's, 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 uh, So Mariano raises a couple calls, including Dan with Ace Queen. He's been so aggressive with three bets today, but he's also snuck in some calls with some pretty good hands. The second pair. Dan turns the best hand. You bet from Dan that the air ball pays, and okay. this should probably go check check here. Okay. Raise from suited. Steiner, it's a tiny, tiny stack. <laughs> Not relevant to this hand, I just happened to notice it. A couple calls here at Nick Airball and Mariano both out flop suited its pocket nines. Check. Check. Boat now for air ball. Check. He's gonna check. go for the check raise, but he's not gonna get the opportunity. Mm-hmm. No bite. Sneaky, sneaky. No bite. No not a very good full house, so I don't wanna. <laughs> I don't want to get raised. I get it. Maybe, maybe, maybe Ace Jack I can bet. Playing too much parallel. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Just check call and pray I'm good. Three bets. Make it five large. And these players are done just meekly putting up with Dan's three bets. Last time he did it, Mike X cold four bet him. This time it's Nick Airball. Oh. 
Uh, just a Modelo, please. Thank yeah, you. Dan doesn't care, though. He makes the call. Sure. Thank you. Interesting flop. <laughs> but not for Dan's hand. $100 straddle on and Mike bumps it up. Make it five large. Tens for Mariano. Mike doesn't really have Super appealing option here. Makes the call. This is more of your stack than you'd ideally prefer to invest with a hand like A7 suited. That's someone. Nice flop from Mariano. Jack's not done with this. Has some back doors here. And that's an awfully good turn card for Mike. Not a bad turn for Mariano either, so. We should be seeing some more action here. Mariano, bet small on the flop. Eleven thousand. Continues firing on the turn. Eleven thousand. Not large. Are you looking for eleven thousand? And what does Mike X want to do? I mean, you can call, but then what do you do on the river if you miss? Could he just chip it in here? Well, yeah, he's going to shove. And he'll quickly get called. So Mike X does have a bunch of equity here. Selling chips. Needs an ace, a four, or a heart. Two hearts. I run two rivers. <laughs> Misses on the first river. Can he find something here on the second river? No. So Mariano is going to stack Mike X. Or just faces. Oh, yeah. Whatever. Whatever. Just any, any winning hand. Yeah. 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 Any ace, any four, any heart. That would be sick. Too many outs in a row. Take it away. Thank you, Magic. Dodge half the deck. So Mike X is going to head to the cage. Mike. 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 Chips 
Sí, es opción. Sí. Okay. Dan defense. Oh, check. check. And two pair for Mariano. Open ender for Dan, but not one where he'll be thrilled about continuing with three diamonds already out there. I say that, but then he puts in the raise. It's snap called. And does not continue firing. Mariano goes very small here. Might be trying to induce something from Dan. Dan just makes the call. Does not get there. Check. Very wet flop, but a pretty bricky run out. Yeah. 36 and uh... And Calling is not an option here for Dan. Looks like he's settled on fold. And another pot heading toward Mariano. So we'll look at our cumulative winnings courtesy of Odds Jam. Nick Arabal, the big winner so far. Mariano, Dan, and Dylan all up pretty significantly. And Mike stuck $100,000. Rough night for him. Heard him say earlier in the show he's going to be out of town for a bit. Be the last time we see him on the show for a few weeks. Sounds like he's going to India. If I understood that right. And this is not the send off he was hoping for. Flush for Mike. Not a whole lot for anybody else to get too excited about. And not the river Mike wanted to see either. <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> no bite. No bite. <laughs> you motherfucker, Mike. <laughs> I was hoping for a nine of club and somebody with an ace in their hand. Mariano bumps it up. Student Superman calls on the button. Am I going to have to press the button again? 2,500. Yep, Dan, three bets. Mike X wakes up with Ace Queen. Four bet. Oh, thanks a lot, man. Pulled four bet, Dan, in a similar spot a half hour or so ago. Give me $200 out of your tray. This time he's just going to call. 2,500. <laughs> Oh, 
Superman in there as well. And a nice flop for Dan. Both for his range and for his actual hand. He bets small. And Superman has some backdoor spades, but that's about it. He lets it go, and Dan's aggression pays off yet again. Thank you, Dan. That guy with the sunglasses is back. <laughs> with the tiny one? Yeah. <laughs> that guy's a legend. Is <laughs> he um, wearing a shirt back? I don't know, but he, the sunglasses don't fit. They don't. No. They look more like goggles. Yeah. So you got a new place finally, Nick? Yeah. Where at? Uh, Huntington Beach. Really? I'm gonna get you a pair of sunglasses like that for your birthday. I'll wear them. Every day. <laughs> <laughs> they have true. to fit that. They have to fit like that. Keep, just go, yeah. buy, <laughs> go buy that pair off of him right now. Yeah. <laughs> the original. He won't oh, part. Who is it? Yeah. He's like a. See him from here? No, he walks. Five five tail up there. He's over there in this one of this five yeah. five guy in the super tight there. shades on. Yeah. Robocop look. <laughs> It's just like too small. <laughs> You've never seen fitted shades. Uh, yeah, it's just like a disaster. Like, they're too small. They don't suit them. Yeah. But he wears them. I hope whoever this Dude, guy is does not listen to this. don't really suit their style is the funniest shit. Like, okay, at the risk of sounding like a dick, Dr. P's shades that he's been rocking, I don't know where he got those. He needs a new style. You know the ones I'm talking about? They're like silver with yeah, like the reflective know, orange know. lenses. I'm like, that's, like <laughs> that's just like some shit my dad would wear. It's like an Indian. But it kind of fits in. Like, door, how does he look at a whole register of sunglasses? He's like, those are the ones. Yeah. That's it. Like, how? Well, when you buy them <laughs> at the gas station. Yeah. <laughs> but even the gas yeah, station has so much like, you know what I mean? even the gas station has something that's better suited for Dr. P. You know? I I agree with you. But he's too, got but these like these like Lance Armstrong looking shades on. I'm like, dude, chill. It looks like he's about to pass. <laughs> yeah, with like the big leather jacket. I'm like, <laughs> just comical. Pass. Great guy, though. Yeah, yeah, of course. Is that like no, an no, Indian know, thing? Shades like, that don't make jacket. any sense. Yeah, I, shit I like Dr. P's so jacket. <laughs> So how's that crib, man? I like it. Yeah. Did you do a lot of work moving in? My wife did. She did it all. Yeah. Nice. Does Look. your dad play poker, Nick? Uh, yeah, a little bit. Nothing like serious. I'll bring him on stream sometime. Also, Dr. P is a great guy. Yeah. He'll play like one-two if there's a one-two game. It's none of my business, but I don't like them talking about him that way. I have some funny stories of him giving me advice after games. Oh, really? <laughs> Tell me. Uh, one, time I remember, one time when I really torched it on stream, he was like, he was talking about like pre flop He's like, you know, when I play poker, he's like, I only play pairs above sevens and then picture cards and suited aces. You should try that for a little bit. <laughs> He's like, you know, you don't need to be so speculative. Like, you can just wait for good hands. He loves to tell me that. He's like, you know, you don't need to be so speculative. Or he says, like, you know, you have a flush draw, like, try to make your flush. Then, then put money in the pot. Like, when you, when you raise people, you just have a flush draw. Like, if you don't make your flush, then you have nothing. <laughs> Steiner's going to try to bluff oh, Mariano out of his pot. And it's going to work. I think like one time I got set over a set on stream and he was like, you know, that's why I don't play small pairs. Cause he's like, if you don't make a set, your hand sucks. If you make a set, someone probably has a bigger one. <laughs> I, was like, I was like, yeah, you're right. <laughs> small house. I don't mind. He means well, I don't mind. I just think it's funny. That's it's like his money at the end of the day, so. He's entitled to an opinion. My dad called me after my whole uh, kerfuffle with Nick about my king's hand. And and I was telling him the whole story, and he's like, but so he doesn't play poker, and he was like, so you have.
King's really good hand, right? And I was like, yeah, well, he's like, it's like, he's like, it's the second best hand, right? And dad's like, why the fuck yeah, did yeah, you take? Like, dude, my dad was on your side. I was like, dad. I'm like, dad, you'll get it. Like, I could have been up against a better hand. He's like, but you have, he's like, just so I understand, you have the best second possible hand. I was like, yeah. Come on. Dad, shut the fuck up. I love the train. Mariano referring to that hand a couple yeah. weeks ago where he faced a six bet jam from Henry and then tanked for a couple minutes before calling it off with Kings. Henry had ace queen off and Nick was not too happy about the time Mariano spent in the tank. Shoved on and like snap, and his dad was like, you know, and Sean's dad was like, you know, there's a lot of hands that can beat you, like, you know, all you lose to every full house, like you can't beat a full you, house. I <laughs> think it's over and there. Sean yeah, was yeah. like, oh, buddy, like I don't. It's, 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 I, Sean Abbey's like, can you tell him it was a cooler? I'm like, it's a fucking cooler, like it's heads up, you have a fucking nut flush, like. What are you? We should have an all dads hustler stream one day. It'd be a very tight, dad, be a very tight yeah, like game. My dad, your dad, yeah. I don't know, my mom gambles, my dad doesn't, so I'll bring my mom. Parents, <laughs> there. Bring, bring your parents yeah. to work there, you know? Brian Feldman's dad works for the show sometimes. Competition for lowest VPIP. <laughs> oh, I got that one. <laughs> Duty calls. <laughs> Duty calls. <laughs> Wednesday, I had to hide. Yeah, because you're a madman these days. 25. All right, Keith. Like, my parents don't care, so. They just, my dad likes to be part of the system. What are your parents so, what, what else do you have coming up? up? Oregon. Uh, Oregon. They're filming oh, in like oh, three sure. weeks out in like Thousand Oaks area. Um, That's so I'm just, like, same as where, like, where Dr. P um, and then I'm yeah, from, yeah, yeah, yeah. kind of where I'm from, yeah, yeah. Uh, same area, April, like within the same 20 minutes. It might be in Ireland, it might be in New York, so I'm not sure yet. Is there like an Indian nice. thing? No, yeah, no, no, so not you know, like, no, 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 a funny character in a, in a comedy. Nice. It's gotta be cool to do like different roles. So how that happen? Like she was like from Oregon too? Up. Or oh, yeah. when you met her, yeah, she, yeah, she awesome. what's that? Yeah, that I, cool. I never yeah. wanted oh. to be myself. Where was that? Younger kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah. Portland, Oregon. Oregon. Oh, okay. So you're both just from Oregon and you decided to move out here? Yeah, she went to college out here and liked it out here. Yeah. So what other movies should we well, watch? Well, out. Card Counter is one of them. Yeah, yeah. Uh, worked out. Yeah. It's a pretty good movie. So how often you go back home? Uh, and then once a year, maybe. Uh, another one. Not as much as you should. Yeah. 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 They come here a while. Like a oh, they do. Yeah. Oh, that works. All right, I'll remember those yeah. three. Yeah. Since I moved out, my parents hardly visit yeah. you. They just demand that you. Two or three times a year, both of our parents' out. family comes in each. However That's long I last in this yeah. LAPC. Oh, you're gonna play the tank game. Have you hosted yeah. yet? Uh, your new crew? Mm -hmm. nice. no. Yeah, I got a seat in it. Satellite won that last night. Oh, it's awesome. Nice. So I have, for how much? How much is your buy-in then? It's a thousand buy-in, and then there was 39 people in it. We played down to three, and the top three got a seat. One of the three was Francisco. He plays right here all the time. <laughs> cool. So it's me, Francisco, and some other dude. And so I sit next to Francisco for hours. Yeah. And we were bullshitting, and then he's like, Ryan just texted me. He said he's got a seat for tomorrow's game if you want it. I'm like, I probably not, but let me see. Let me, let me win this seat first, and then I won't have He's very disciplined. He's like, I'm going to do one more. Yeah. Yeah. If it's meant to be, it's meant to be. So Francisco is the one to blame for this huge L you're taking right now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You're blaming him. Yes, yeah, sir. He is to blame. <sighs> Why Steiner. isn't he here if he won the C2? Down uh, he, more he tonight. He has something else to do. Yeah. He has to rest. Then he won in the satellite. <laughs> Study up. Meditate. Bros can't play every day. The chicken man. He's got that seat tomorrow. He's got to get ready for tomorrow. All right, you know what? No one raised, please. Whoa. 
something different. Yeah. Pimpin. Oh, Limpin limp. is pimp. Oh. There you go. He's not going to get his wish. Yeah. I thought it was going to be Dan. Really? I feel him? Well, I there's, people, we there's people watching, I'm Mariano. I got to I gotta play it. <laughs> you got to raise this <laughs> in. After, after the flop, I'll, sh I'll put him. <laughs> too, emba too embarrassed hand. right now. Yeah, mystery hand. <laughs> <laughs> hasn't put his, his cards in the box I've yet. Okay. But the box hasn't looked. And there's a queen. Bottom pair for Mariano, but he lets Damn, it go. Uh, Sorry, Wednesday. Oh, Wednesday, yeah. I'm supposed to fly back on Thursday, yeah. Oh, okay. Cool. Where's the so what's the crib like? You got some whaley? Uh, Nothing crazy. Yeah, yeah, nice house. Yeah. Dogs? Nick said he's yeah. going to try to join me there, too. Yeah. I honestly don't play PLO, but yeah. apparently it's like but a big party Yeah. 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 Um, we both liked it. Who found it? Me. How'd you find it? Just looking on Zillow and stuff like that. Is it's it like a HOA thing? Just a standalone house? Just a house, yeah. Nice. What year was it built? No, I didn't. It, 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 it just remodeled. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, because a lot of stuff near the beach, like, a lot of that real estate's been taken for a long time. Yeah, I have no idea what it's going any of that. I just know the last owner, like, remodeled it or whatever. Did you meet the owners, the previous owners at all? Okay. Well, that's dope. It's close enough to here, too, right? So a free bet from Mike Axe. Oh, okay. Monotone flop. Yeah. What do you do, just the 405 over here? Yeah, I think so. Right? <laughs> and Dan doesn't have much of a piece That's of this right. at all. I forgot you're a donk driver. Just follow the GPS. You, li you live out here too. Yeah. How long have you been out here? Um, I, was, I was born in Argentina and then uh, since since moving to this country, we've been in SoCal the whole time. Yeah. A little bit, Mike? What, are the what about you, you Arizona? Yeah. Born and raised? Yeah. Nice. Scottsdale, um, too? Um, um, no, so more right. like uh, really my uh, adult uh, life, Scottsdale. Yeah. Yeah, those are both the one thing. Childhood. Yeah, they'll be down. Different parts of Phoenix area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Phoenix, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Phoenix is like considered it's huge. There's yeah. Mesa, yeah. Tempe, and Scottsdale, and Glendale, and there's 10 different cities that are yeah. Phoenix. Well, just do one is there one called Chandler? Is that a thing? Okay, yeah. Chandler. I visited Chandler once. Have some family there. Yeah. Long, long time ago, before Phoenix like exploded. Mariano, yeah, yeah. you want to do a shot with us? You can see that. Uh, fuck. Shot of what? Tequila. Tequila. Uh, <laughs> how can I say no? We're at peer pressure. Just one. How can I say and no? He, and he barely turned red, and all his fan and YouTube vlog was like, oh my god, Mariano drinks. Stop drinking. Yeah, they hate <laughs> when I drink. They, yeah, they go crazy. I'm like, dude. Yeah. Let the man live a little. Yeah. <laughs> All right, one. One. One right. key. But I'm not paying for it. <laughs> Magic pay. Pace, pace, pace no, no, pace. key pays for it. That <laughs> from Dan. Mariano makes the call. Lauren pays for it. And Dan <laughs> picks up a gut shot. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Trips for Mariano. Fielder. There it is, eight ball. Tiny bet. Corner pocket. Gets through. Dude, I was trying to order a, a margarita on Wednesday. Oh yeah. my god. And There's I could not for the life of me remember like the name of that cocktail, so I had to describe a margarita. Oh. <laughs> I got roasted for like 20 minutes about it. Yeah, I was like, like, what's uh, the cocktail with like tequila? Tequila and martini. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think you said sunrise at one point. Too. I said sex on the beach. Sex on the beach. Sex on the beach. Just pathetic. <laughs> I don't drink often. I remember my first cocktail. Pretty much, yeah. Every cocktail <laughs> feels like my first. I like nice cocktail bars. You know, like craft cocktails. Oh, yeah. that, that I can get with. Oh. Mike X opens, Nick calls. 
What's Mariano cooking up here? Nothing. No craft cocktails for this one. Dylan in there as well. Backdoor flush draws for everybody, but not a whole lot else. Mike Betts, Nick calls. And Mike turns a flush draw. He's gonna check now. And Nick checks it back. Hoping that his ace is good. Beats of queen jacks, jack tens, hands like that. Check, check, and Mike's gonna win a small one. I'm gonna take a two minute break, I'll be right back. Are you winning and complaining at the same time? Go watch it, I take a shower or something. No, yeah. Maybe it's you, Mike. You're in the hand, so you can take the cocktail One more, yeah. I'll take one more. I'll take one more. Four, you guys four. are doing it. I'm done tipping four, magic. Four, 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 Thank you guys. Sorry about that. Yeah, you in the hands. So I didn't want to like. Dude. No, no, yeah. I appreciate it. Yeah. Shows up to work with. They're like his work shoes. Just Yeezys. I'm gonna try those like 500 bucks or something. How much Friday are your shoes, night, man? You know? Yeah. 200? Okay. Can you just get some shoes at Walmart for work? Gotta get $200 Yeezys. <laughs> I wear the Walmart ones when I go out. Okay, yeah. I, I better see you out with those. <laughs> Fucking rude. He's rich. I'm done tipping him. Yeezy's at work. Round of straddles? One more? Sure. Yeah. Alright, round of straddles. I'd love to. Huh? I said I'd love to. Yeah, I bet. Right? I have the perfect stack for that, yes. Yeah, you do. All right. It's double up time. I agree. I think it is double up It's double up time. Easy double. I need one. Nick will double you up. You won't even notice. Dylan can double me up. He's been winning yeah. today. No hand needed. <laughs> you still got Dan in the hand. Yeah. There's three of you. Let me, let me. <laughs> Oh, quick, Tommy. The doubles are tall, right, Nick? That would be crazy. You look good, right, Nick? Take a trail, Tommy. Just take it out of there. Feels bad, man. What's up with that? Where's, where's he been at? So you obviously yeah. prefer uh, PLO. Uh, yeah, let me leave the thing on PLO. The wind. Um, it's more enjoyable. Um, what about I, I do uh, like, Mariano has games sometimes. And you can tell me uh, to shut the fuck up. Like, I should talk about it because I have no I'm idea. No what about the sun? Can I turn it all? Or? Yeah. No, what's going on? The guy who put on the show? Yeah. Pro yeah. I was well, playing a lot of... I don't know. Oh, he's not right on it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I remember it being real cool. <laughs> yeah. I, uh... It's not really cool. What, what? Do I owe money, Horn? No. Yeah. 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 Dan, three bets. Dan's 89th three bet of the day. Got it for Dylan. Not much there for Dan. Not that that's stopped him much tonight.
Works out for him. It's good for your mental too to do that. Your mental could use some some help, I'm sure. Nick. Size six D chat twenty four seven. <laughs> Take a fucking walk, dude. Walk it off. <laughs> I don't even think uh, Nick's capable of feeling stress anymore. Those receptors are like burned out. You yeah. Know? Just tilt. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like he he could be on a plane and the the pilot's like brace for impact and Nick's like fuck. So annoying, you know. <laughs> Just tilt it. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Mariano opens, gets one call. And Mike flops two pair. It's out of the way on the turn, despite picking up a gutter. $100 straddle. Yes, sir. I'm qualified. Suited raises. Mariano calls. Bottom pair for Mariano. Small bet for Superman. Mariano does not quickly call here. There it is. It's a raise. Interesting. Blocking, bottom set, wanting to get also some hands like suited had to, to go ahead and fold, I think. It's a raise that can set up a multi-street bluff, and it's also a raise that can protect your bottom pair when suited has one of his many combinations of either one or two over cards. That's, the, that's your straddle. Dan takes down another small pot. He's really been taking down tons of small pots tonight. Oh my god. Get a double for everyone. Yeah. So total. Why does it feel like it's 11? Oh, thank you, sir. I appreciate it. I mean, it is for me. I just fucking woke up. The room is hot enough, thing might ignite. Oh my god. Dude, I'm <laughs> yeah. Fucking, god. <laughs> One spark away from disaster. Another small pot for Dan. 
Oh, he will. <laughs> Thank you. It's so, it's so horrible. Thank it's you, just been you. relentless Thank tonight. You. Cheers, 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 cheers. Oh, cheers, boys. Cheers. Don't forget your uh, absolute pleasure. Let's see if the liquid courage oh, makes yeah. these players any more eager to stand up to him. The chip bag? That's the chippies. That's the what's left of them. What's left of them? <laughs> that was the chip bag. <laughs> it, was, it was a nice chip bag. Right. Who bought those? Yeah, wake you up. Dan. Dan? Sorry? You got those ricks? Yeah. Thank Not you. cool. Uh, Double straddle, <laughs> right? Yeah. They really Not fill cool them. Not cool at all. Yeah. Race from Steiner and playing a very short stack and runs into a better ace here. What an odd raise. Sort of an odd raise, but he's he, Steiner's playing a small stack. And even a small raise in this situation sends a clear message that Steiner's gonna have to play for all of his chips here. Which he All will right, do. do one time. One time it is left. And thirteen thousand dollar pot. Steiner in some trouble here. Ryan Steiner, the two-time Arizona oh, State Poker Champion. I'll kill you, Keith. <laughs> if it's a chop, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not kidding. It's the late addition to the lineup tonight. Uh, how much do you love your life? You both have ace high. It's fair. Chop. I'll kill you. <laughs> <laughs> you never drink? Nothing there for him. Needs a 10. Uh, every once in a while. I've seen Nick drinking. There's some clip of that Can't find night. one. I, I play like one game a week where I drink a lot. Yeah, no sugar. Um, a yellow game or a whatever it is. Half, half. Game on Monday we're going to? No, it's not that one. And it didn't sound like Steiner said goodbye or anything like that, so we'll see if he comes back. But I'll tell you what. On Sunday, I'm playing a really big game in Vegas. If I win a bunch, we can get wasted on Monday. So you're going to fly to Vegas and then fly back? Well, what are you guys playing in Vegas? Uh, like... I mean, it's advertised as 100, 200, 400 PLO, but it's going to be like... The Oscars? No, it's oh. uh, another guy's running the game. Six. It's, it's going to be like super action yeah, PLO, so... It'll be a question of how good I run. <laughs> is he walking off or is he walk off? That's what I was asking. <laughs> And but he took his chip pouch this time. Yeah. Pouch. Although he didn't give his mic pack back, so I was like, oh. yeah, but that might be like a steam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, steam for Dan's gonna raise it here. You get the Uber and you're Some like, back doors. <laughs> oh mother fuck! Fuck! I gotta go back. That's like and one time I was so fucking scared. Like X is clearly wise to Dan's antics here. Left. And then I'm on like in the car and I get a call from the dude. It's like, a great turn card. Like, and you need to sign this. I was like, I'm not coming back. <laughs> like, I'm fucking out of here. Like, Dan does I'm not keep firing. I'm not turning around coming back to that fucking casino. <laughs> it's interesting, Mike checks back. Which is great. <laughs> if he knows that Dan has eight high. And Mike's check on the turn is gonna induce another block from Dan. But is Mike considering raising here? Yep. Very sneaky. Damn. Should have taken that shot. <laughs> Out of the way. With the eight high. Mike, buy another 
the shot. Don't, don't, don't blame the alcohol. I'll pay this time. <laughs> Chad Dellen giving out five chat pro memberships. Thank you, Chad. I thought there were two. Yeah. Two K trials. Oh, maybe there was, yeah, I don't know. I think it was two K trials. He put some big trials on. Put, yeah. putting on some fatties. And then he lost every... <laughs> yeah, every single lost, one. He lost them all, yeah. Two pair for Mike. He just, like, defended them and then buffed it off. Yeah. Mariano probably won't be too interested in continuing here, but... He got snapped. Even though he does have a heart. Oh, he does make a call as Mike bets small. What's up, Greg? And Greg's gets there. The schlub? Schlub tortured him. Got mad at him for giving him shit. <laughs> I don't like it when anyone people do that big pots. He's going to try to squeeze out a little bit of value here. Not easy to do, but the best players do try. Schlub? Yeah, yeah. He's come out here before I put it. And then uh, Ryan used to, the bike had like a, it's not like a Baccarat room, but they used to have this room called Legends of Poker Room, which is like a private room. Right. And Ryan used to host uh, 1025 games in there like, uh, like six years ago, maybe, or something like a long time ago. Oh, so I, you've known him forever. I, I mean, I played in those games and he played a couple times, maybe. So like I've you know, the known him forever. Oh, right, yeah. Thank you. Nice guy. Yeah. Nick bumps it up, Dan just calls from the first blind. Mike X in there too. Small bet from Nick, should get the job done, but you never know with Dan. Turns a flush draw. And has the best hand with Queen High. And Queen High is still good, so a pretty ambitious call, three ways on the flop, but. 500. Two to show. <laughs> Dan snaps off this very small riverbed as well. Okay. That's a, a showdown that'll have Nick Arabal talking to himself a little bit. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Shots. <laughs> Can't wait, someone to do a remix of. Yeah. Once again? No, no. Any word from our friend? Three. Nope. These players wondering if Steiner is going to come back. Free bet from Nick. And Dan gets out of the way. Mike said 800. 
straddle and a reef straddle. Two. Nick Airball bumps it up. Suited dominates him. And Nick's just going to shove. All in to call for suited Superman. With a very good but not great hand. Surely knows that Nick is capable of some craziness here. He's in trouble against all of Nick Airball's value range, except maybe Jack's. Easy to say when you could see that Nick has King Queen that it's a call, but I don't think that in Suited's exact situation, it, it is an easy call. Am I dead? Uh? It does make the correct call. Twice. No, I'm not dead. 86k in the pot. Ace queen. I'm dead. <laughs> no. 86k in there. Suited Superman correctly calls it off. He's a four to one favorite. I'm such an idiot. Wants to a ten here for Nick. As well as a king. Nick slow rolling me. <laughs> There's the 10. Oh, man. So the nut straight for Nick Airball. King ball. Tried to ignite it. Okay, now we got a nice three roll. Lauren. <laughs> Shit. If I, Lauren, you wanted to punish Key. If you punish <laughs> Key, you get 1,000. 1,000 for you, Lauren. Let's, we'll make back that 18,000 slowly. <laughs> Let's punish him. <laughs> so hey. Nick is going to free key. roll. Suited Superman here. <laughs> That's me, 40,000. Come on. God, I want these chips. Let's see what they feel like. Oh, yeah, they feel good. Okay. These are not. So good. Are these mine? How much is this? How much should I just make here? 30, 40. He's got, he's got Suited Superman's on, chips Warren. in his hand. Is it paint? No. Let's chop it up. Come on, dude. Oh, the, the reverse. I see it. I, see it. I mean, there is a king of diamonds in there. That's me! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Lauren. Slowly. Oh my God. Slowly. Oh my God. Superman Remember, needs to fade a king. Good. You know it. You know you yeah, want to. Yeah, me, huh? Hurt him, Lauren. Hurt him. Expensive card, right? Hurt him, Lauren. Expensive. That's me! Damn it. Ah, uh, chop it up. Good oh. thing is not once. <laughs> Such a luck box. Oh my God. Finally, I made a good call with his Nick. Jesus. What are you doing? Can you fold your fucking ace queen? Too pretty. It's fucking fifty thousand dollars. How rich are you? Suited. No, forty only. They don't Wait, call him suited for nothing. Is that an actual all-in? Yeah, with the Fortnite Strato, he raised to two k, and uh, make it seven k jam. You're crazy. <laughs> And I'm like, you, you only live twice. Let's run it twice. <laughs> how did you, yeah, how did you get it to run twice? Uh, Nick inflicted too much pain on me this week, so he, he felt bad. <laughs> uh, I have to run it twice. Thank you. Uh, I call and we chop. And, uh, yeah. Aces, ace king, chop. No shot. Suited <laughs> <laughs> you know Superman referring to ace battling with Nick and Queen. PLO. Suited? Out on the floor. <laughs> so, much more, so much more like <laughs> King Queen double suited? That's awesome. He just dropped, like, turned me dead on the, on the first board. <laughs> I mean, not that long. 
So don't forget, <laughs> if you're in L.A., don't have plans on Monday, come down to Hustler Casino because we're giving away a seat on Max Payne Monday in a 5K free roll. So if you're seated... Kind of. A couple years ago, I had... If you're seated at, at certain poker games, but if you're seated... Monday afternoon, Hustler Casino is going to give away a seat. I never thought I'd be a TV star when I grew to up. To a seated player for Max Payne Monday. Me and Dylan. So you get on the show and mix it up it's with... the real life rounders. 5,000 bucks. <laughs> Lauren, almost did it. Oh my God. Wow, that would have been sweet, Lauren. Oh my God. A sweet revenge. <laughs> I thought she was going to do it. it felt, Dan, three bets. It felt like she was going to do it. And like I run so good against you and on the has, show. And he has oh, it yeah. this time. God, I thought you were just going to fucking fold. Oh, the star line. Ooh, clean for Mariano. Don't make that call. Fold. Let me get it through. I'm fine. What the fuck? So a bet and a call, and Dan's gonna keep firing. Mariano calls again. Oh, okay. And that time I just ignited it to you. Try. Pretty bricky like, river cards. How much value does Dan think he can get here? No, I was like, please have ace jack. <laughs> Pretty hard for Mariano not to have something here. He went in the tank and gave me the I have a good hand speak. I was like, that sounds like ace queen. Like Ace Queen you snap. Jackson higher, you snap. Tens, I don't know if you give me the good hand speech. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I'm just dead. 16 8 dead from Dan. Dan. But I found a way out. And this feels like a call for Mariano. Dan has been so aggressive all night. Mariano's got a good hand. Having the king of spades is not the best, but that's less important than is this guy going to have enough bluffs here? And I think the answer is yes. But Mariano disagrees, and he is correct. Nice fold, very nice fold by Mariano. High level fold. Suited, suited man. Can't <laughs> fucking find the fold one fucking time. Suited. So, suited. Nick Airball still the big winner, up fifty thousand dollars. Dan up thirty-eight thousand. Yeah, it's a suited parking lot. And Mike X <laughs> stuck almost a hundred thousand. As you look at our. Cumulative winnings courtesy of Odds Jam. Dan playing 52% of hands with a ton of opens and three bets. Really aggressive stuff. Impressive performance all around by Dan tonight. Why you gotta put me through that stress? You stack me, you just like call to see the flop, turn, oh, river, you make a nut straight, you make a second nut straight. You're too shallow. <laughs> just go all in and gamble with you. <laughs> Maybe we're flipping, you know? You're strong. No, I'm gonna go smoke. Yeah. 
Oh, instead, you have me dead. Sorry, buddy. I almost got you unstuck from yesterday. <laughs> that would have been. Then you would have got my action every day. <laughs> Mike X with top pair in a gutter. Mariano does not turn any additional outs. He does not keep bluffing. Mariano took a bet check bet line like this as a bluff earlier tonight. It did not work then and it will not work now. myself I've paid you all night long why stuff now right exactly you keep that up Mike <laughs> you give it to me I give it to Dan Dan absorbs I've got, it. A, I've got kings a lot against you like many times today? Nice. Uh, at least at least twice today wow so, very nice those are good hands <laughs> those are good hands yeah. yeah one of the best nice hand either way I think my biggest hand was Ace Queen. Yeah. I haven't had any of these. Yeah. yeah, but no, no big. Fans. I've gotten kings I mean, against you uh, zero times. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> time, I have. Um, <laughs> it's fair. <to> be honest. <laughs> I poke nines. Poke nines and Ace Queen. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I think we're good. Mariano has Dan pipped here. I hope they have more PLO stream, but... I like your strategy, Dan. Just let me win small pots so you can kick my ass on okay. the big ones. Um, <laughs> it's getting more popular. Actually. Pretty good one. Yeah. I think the game itself. Uh, PLO is... I got a cooler mic again. Get some of my money back. Need to be... <laughs> Maybe like... Um, I don't know. I don't know what would attract... Like viewers, I think, it's, I think it's a tough right. watch sometimes for people that don't know the game. Yeah, I think that's the toughest part right now. Yeah. Race for Mike. Dan makes the call. Flops okay. an ace. So Dan's got clear value bet here. That's 3,000 and Mike X quickly out of the way.
Again, just calls. Mike in the $400 straddle. Raises this up. Obviously a pretty trashy hand. And a 10 for Dan. And good board for Mike to fire at. I mean, if you're going to fire at anything with six dues off. Dan going nowhere. He turns two pair, wow. Mike does not continue bluffing. River's a six. One liner to an eight out there. But I think Dan can still squeeze out a value bet here. Something on the smaller side to target. Should be a pretty weak range. He agrees. That's about 40%. And Mike doesn't have a hand good enough to call here. But does have a hand he thinks he can raise. Interesting. 7,000. Might think that Dan doesn't have a nine, or excuse me, an eight when he uses the sizing. And it might work. I mean, I think one slight problem is that he just has so much stuff because of what happened pre-flop. Dan makes the call. Oh, that wasn't good. <laughs> <laughs> was... There's just a lot of random nonsense he can potentially turn up with. That was a good effort. I, yeah, it, was, it had me really confused. <laughs> Also a pretty small raise. Away with that shit more often than not. <laughs> All right, guys, thanks so much. I was glad you called him, Dan. He's been getting away with this shit for months. Yeah. Can't let you do me like that on stream, Mike. Show a deuce after. <laughs> oh my god. I been so don't forget, Monday, Max Payne Monday. Be here in the afternoon. Be sitting in a poker game and you have a chance to win a seat on a Max Payne Monday and be staked $5,000. So pretty awesome promotion here at Hustler. Monday. Come be on the show. Win a seat. Be on the show. Three six. Chance to, to, chance to get the money back. Magic, your, f your first name on ID is Magic? No way. Really? That's your, that, did you change your name? Five large. Dan, three bets. One of your house. It's your stage name. Another small pot for Dan. <laughs> Whatever stage you're on. <laughs> Dan has been playing like a boss. Just a complete boss. Welcome, buddy. Just running this game. Hmm. 
Big slick from Nick. Just a call from Dylan, and Suited just calls as well. That'll, I was going to say that'll bring in Mike X, but it looks like he's going to three bet. Too large. The calling is standard here, but this is not the craziest three bet I've ever seen. Four bet from Nick puts Dylan and Superman in awkward spots. And Dylan gets out of the way. Take a moment, say your goodbye. <laughs> How much do you have? <laughs> Nick has Mike covered, of course. Mike's going to call. Problem with this is it's just a really hard spot to play if you don't flop a seven, which Mike does not, not at all. Trips for Nick Airball. And Mike does not fold. It looked like a seven for, for a second. Would have been a boat for Dylan. Not that it would have been at all easy for him to get to this point in the hand. Very milky bet from Airball. I think Mike has to pitch this now. He does. Hey, yes, ma'am. Absolutely. All right. I'm, I'm getting out of their way. I'm, thinking oh, I'm hungry. They have like. What did you have, though? Eight, five, two. Jack, try one, sir. You got away with murder. Nick, you want one, right? Huh? You want one, right? No, I'm okay. Thank you. Hey? Are you sure? <laughs> no, I don't want one. I'm good. Casino yeah, passing out hors d'oeuvres throughout the day. I'll take one. It's part of Player Appreciation Day. I'll take one. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. Yes, ma'am. Looks really good. Thanks. You can miss me. Don't touch my fucking food. Thank you so much. Aces for Dylan. Oh, shit. This one is falling out. <laughs> you know, before the they've come up here, and I've been like, I'm going to take three. And the care ball. <laughs> taking three. <laughs> a good hand to crack aces. We got like 100K. I'm all shy about the free meatball. <laughs> Mariano comes along as well. Top set Check. for Dylan. Check. Very dry board. Don't mind the check. Hard spot to get paid. Check. Check. And he's got two players Check. who could easily start bluffing. Nobody does, though. And Dylan checks on, the turn. Dude. What are you doing here, buddy? <laughs> and now he's betting the river. If you knew what I had, you would be like, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> Dylan basically telling him what he has. <laughs> you dust. You're like, you have to bet. <laughs> All right. Oh, okay. Fair. <laughs> Fair card. <laughs> that makes sense, right? <laughs> yeah, <it> makes sense. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Dylan shows the ace of spades only. Is it good? Another shot. Oh. 
I think I think uh, yeah, we can do one more. Three hundred. Dylan? Yeah, it's on me. Alright, I got this round. Right. Are we on our shot? Please, Magic. Another nice Anybody starting hand for three, Dylan. Three, just three shots. Yeah. 2,000. But a nicer Four. one for Nick. How do you say Bases for both players. Dylan is out kicked. This could get messy for him. Small bet and a quick call. Nick's kicker still plays. Go small here. This pot is a lot smaller than it maybe could be, but neither player knows how strong the other is. I call. I call. And just a quick call from Dylan. Not much point in raising, I don't think. Queen plays. Yeah, queen plays. Since. Aces with worse That's kickers it. chop with you anyway. So Dylan doesn't get stacked. Does lose a 20k pot though. That damn kicker, Nicky. <laughs> damn kicker. <laughs> Just one pip. The 400 is on the sand. I That's saved myself a little money there, I think. You did for sure. And it didn't raise turn. I was like, oh, I, I, bet this I had a flush draw too. I, I know. Oh, you had a flush draw too? Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. No, I, was like, I was like, I what? <laughs> How is that possible? So, big fucking hand. Trip yeah. aces with a 10 kicker. Yeah, I know. Dangerous board for both of us. Didn't feel good. Yeah, didn't feel that good. Nah, yeah, yeah. No. So are you going to be miserable without poker for a month, Mike? It's going to be interesting not playing for a month. It's going to be a big change. Yeah. I mean, I'm going to be super busy, but I'm going to miss poker. Nick, you move over to the last little bit? Why are you not playing for a month? I'm traveling overseas. Oh, nice. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to be comfortable. I'm spread out. India, Indonesia. Better angle right here. I don't give a fuck. Tell them to install more cameras. <laughs> it's not enough. Race. Right, Race from go. Nick and Mike Defense. I'm to double me up. Even as a courtesy, that I wouldn't even notice. I know. That's what I'm saying. King for Two Mike. Up before, you know. Two doubles? Got her for Nick, which he hits. You can't hats for so fucking much, yeah. Mike. You gotta be reasonable with your request. Mike is calling again. That's the weirdest call I've ever seen. <laughs> And 10 on the river should give Mike a parachute here. Two thousand. Two what? what? And he's donking at this. Kind of turning his king into a bluff. That's weird. Where is? 5,000. And it's not going to work out for him. And 
Mike ran a bluff against Dan 15 minutes or so ago that did not work on, and this one does not work either. I was going to say, apparently you can get pretty drunk off beers. 10, 20, 40, Yeah. Maybe. Oh, tequila. They start that up. It's 10, 20, 40. The tequila? Yeah. It's been crazy the last two days. Yeah. Why? Because the special someone was there. I've been fucking playing every fucking day. Is that a thousand? Yeah. Dan raises, takes it down. So Nick Airball, still the biggest winner as you look at our cumulative winnings courtesy of Odds Jam. Dan up $52,000. Mariano up as well. Mike X stuck $123,000. And Steiner came here from Arizona and lost $30,000. The problem is once I once it becomes 10, 20, 40, it's hard to move down to 10, 20. Yeah. We've been trying to just like at least well, start 20, the game. 20, 40, 80 lately. Yeah, I mean we try and start again with 10, 20, but you know everyone is just. Let there be blood. Thirsty. Let there be blood. <laughs> oh, they, they too thirsty. <laughs> but then too many people in the poker hospital, you know, after mm -hmm. 10, 20, 40, 80, 160, nice. 320. Always difficult running a game like Suited Superman is describing, where you're worried about the game just getting too big and people going bust and the game not running anymore. Yeah. I think we almost get at that point. Like today, the game started without me in many days. You're you know? in for one fourth. So, almost to the point where I'm just saying. So, you got 70 from you. I'm going to play whenever I want to. So, this is that's, that's really the main reason yeah, why I started like, the game. Yeah, I got another 30 if you want to make it one. I have a game that I want to play, <laughs> the second one to play, and then I can play whenever I want. And if 170 is not enough, I got 30. Easy for you to encounter, guys. And then we'll remember you too. When you leave to your little trip for a month, we'll be thinking about your little sweet 200 you left us. Home games, you know, like, you gotta wait for them. <laughs> 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 breaking huge, you know. Yeah. So race from Dan, defend from Mariano. Five, five, no limit. Nick. And a nice spot for Dan. Four. Look at Bertucci. Nick Bertucci. Bertucci's here to practice from five, five. Mariano raises it up here. Interesting. He's got backdoor spades and a straight draw. Unless, like, you know, someone want to go party somewhere. Did you go to that party last night? No, I'm going tonight. Oh, tonight, okay. Want to go? Let me know if you go. Yeah, yeah we're going to go. Like, we're after? Yeah. Um, I have a driver here. Yeah? All right. And I think the, the problem with... 35 on dough. This bluff is, well, there's two. It's just not enough equity, and it's on a board where Dan can just have a lot of stuff. It doesn't want to fold. Pairs with straight draws. Two pairs, straights, sets. Two clubs now. Mariano, if he keeps betting, is really mostly saying he has 10-9. I guess he could have some King Jack offsuit type hands as well. Also, of course, some backdoor clubs, but he doesn't have a club in his hand. He bets pot, though. 
hours? Your hawk is the poker. Oh. <laughs> That's what I need to Dan has the king of clubs in his hand, which is nice. <clears throat> And if you're going to do what Mariano is doing, definitely better to fire three times than to fire twice and give up. Because firing three times puts a lot of hands like King-10, Queen-10, Jack-10, Ace-Queen in a pretty irritating spot. Nick B2550. He's here to play bigger, too. Ace King as well. Four days for Dan makes the call. Good call. Continues running over the table. So a courageous attempt by Mariano. Dan <laughs> looks him up yeah. with one pair. Uh, Get the round, Dylan. Really? You got this? Thank you so much, buddy. You get there eventually. Cheers. Yeah. It's kind of like you, like, so good, you know? Yeah, I just, just such good players here. Yeah. I just, just like, Dan has made so many good plays there. tonight. <laughs> all in? I'm all in? Three. Dan's given a ton of action too. Just a really impressive performance oh, all around. Me, man. Not just winning by turning up with good hands over and over. I can hit more than you. True. Slow play. Actually, yeah, that's probably what's gonna happen. Yeah. Yeah. Winning by picking off a lot of small pots and thinking very clearly in a lot of important oh, situations. Wait, so quads for Mariano and two players with over pairs. Great spot for Mariano. He's like, oh, that's me. It's Keith. <laughs> It's juice, it's juice, juice. Like, and, oh, it's me. So Nick bets, and both Mariano and Superman make the call, and this six shouldn't really dissuade Airball or Superman from putting more money in here. Seven thousand from Airball. I think actually, now that. Airballs bet again three ways here. Superman can get out of the way. Even if Mariano just calls. Which he does. What a dream. Quads for Mariano. And an aggressive player firing into you. Three spades out there now. And air ball now does lose to some 4x of spades. I was already behind 4x of spades. But some backdoor spades that Mariano could conceivably have. Some pocket pairs have also made full houses. Still value betting the jacks and he is not going to love what happens next raise it up bump it up big raise 55 large 55 grand from mariano And now, Nick's hand is just not that strong. Oh, 
He's not capped at all in this spot. Can have tons of better hands than this. Can have some boats. Can have some 4X, can have some flushes. But he's still thinking about looking up Mariano here. value betting this river from Nick's perspective was already arguably a little bit thin. So when you get raised, it's probably time to let it go. Mariano's reputation precedes him a little bit here, though. Certainly, he's someone who could turn up with some weird bluffs. Even in lines like this, that for most players in the population are comically underbluffed. What do I want to do? I have an overpass. This line of call, call, raise river. If you see this at your local casino, you should fold and feel really good about it the vast majority of the time. But Mariano, a very capable player, which is why Nick's got calling chips in his hand. does make the call and Mariano is going to win a $135,000 pot flopping quads against Nick Airball's jacks. Mariano raises big and gets paid and Nick rolling his eyes and reaching for another 100,000 in chips. Turn on the fan. Yeah. Mariano, by chance, are four is your favorite hand or no? <laughs> now, now it is for sure. Do you have a favorite hand? Uh, no. He's definitely not Chinese. My right hand. Dan. Dan, you want to hook me up? <laughs> Sorry? Yeah. That's awesome. Oh my God. <laughs> That's legitimately awesome. Um, I thought you were bluffing that too. Uh, Did you keep? <laughs> you have like eight, seven. Yeah. yeah. Nick adds on the tilt chips. Thank you. Make it 1500. Mariano raises it up. Superman, three bets. Quite a small three bet. <laughs> Mariano makes the call and flops a pair of sevens, but Superman with a monster draw. Gutter and a flush draw. And Mariano just gets out of the way. 
middle pair that rarely improves. Not a great hand to have in the three bet pot out of position there. Thought you would get quads in PLO. You know, no limit players can get quads too. <laughs> very, very rare. Yeah. <laughs> Small here and not much there for Mike X. Suddenly the table a lot quieter. It's Nick staring off into space clearly. Wondering if he maybe made the wrong decision. Um, Toronto probably like six months of the year. Five. Yeah. I thought you left, Stanley. Thought you were gone, man. I tried. Tried to leave. They wouldn't let you. No. You walk yeah, they, they locked the doors. <laughs> yeah. Walking out to the parking lot and found ten grand on the, on the floor. Oh yeah, I got it. I got it. like. So Steiner's back. Nice guys. I'm it's to be. He's away from the table for well. something like an hour. But he's returned. And raises to 500. And Dan squeezes. And of all the players at the table, Mike X seems... Most keen on finding a way to stop Dan. He calls. Steiner playing a short stack and decides not to go with the ace jack. Yep. All right, let's go. Heads up. Thank you. Dan with the best of it here. Check. Mike Cole called a three bet. All right, check, check. That should eliminate the very best hands from his range, but. You should have mostly hands that are pretty good here. And on a board like this, pocket eights is quite tricky to play against a range like that. Mike checks it back again. And Dan He's going to put out a value bet. I was wondering if he was going to do that. It's a really good play, so I'm not really surprised that he found it. Thinks that Mike has a lot of ace-queen, ace-jack, perhaps, type hands. Wants to squeak out a little bit of value. And Mike just lets the ace-nine go. Dan, or excuse me, Nick, adds on 300,000 now. A bunch of the Kobe's.
So I'm Charlie Wilmoth. I'll be with you for another 45 minutes tonight. And then, oh, so what's this? Just like an extra table? Uh, so this one is the uh, oh. main game, and then I think they just started a must move. Oh, okay, okay. Usually okay. it feel around like eight, yeah. nine, but is this your game that I'm streaming at right now? No, it's oh. a, the, the one, I think that one's a limit, limit hold game. It sounds fun, man. I want to play. PLO, yeah. yeah I want to play. Yeah, I like I don't really know how, but it's so fun every time I do. I was thinking the same thing. I want to play, Let's but play I don't it. know how. <laughs> yeah. so. I'd, be, I'd be down to try it. Let's play it. Yeah, whenever whenever you're down, just mm -hmm. just text me. Check. I'll make sure you get a seat. Is it like an everyday thing? Yeah, every day now. Wow. Two, three games sometimes. Look what you did. <laughs> yeah. Check. Two, two, three. So if you want to follow me on Twitter, I'm at third walking. That's third spelled out walking. You find links from there to my poker podcast, which is called Third Man Walking. Yeah, I know. Wow, Mariano. Get Steiner to fold a pair. And let's look at our updated leaderboard courtesy of Odds Jam. Dan takes the lead here up 73,000. Mariano now up 68,000. A couple other players up small. Mike X stuck 128,000. And Steiner down over 30K. Dan winning the most while playing 50% of hands. Mariano winning the second most by playing while playing 43% of hands, uh, and the two loosest players at the table the game are the two biggest winners. Start by itself now. So. That's good. Yeah. Two stories of the day being Nick Airball calling off minutes ago in that huge pot against Mariano where Mariano flopped quads. And Dan running over the table a very impressive display of loose aggressive poker. Mike X with bottom set here. Mariano with a gutter. Now an open ender. Mike X. Looked like a nine for a second. Boat for Mike. So he's had a very, very rough night, but he's about to get some money back here. Shelves and Mariano. No choice but to let this go. Just prefer live. Less dead, gifting a chat membership. Thank you. Just had a draw. I missed. It's more like social game, you know? Like online. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, house draw. <laughs> I had Queen Jack. Didn't get there on the river. Straight 
finally made a hand. I'm like, okay. <laughs> gonna... Sorry. I was trying to cooler you. Yeah. If I had made my straight, you would have folded though, right? <laughs> You're in the folding mood tonight. Definitely folding. How did you meet uh, Christine? Uh, she's a good friend of mine. She lives in Toronto as well. Yeah. She plays um, uh, some mutual high stakes party games. Okay. Yeah. She's a really, really nice girl. Do, do you know her in person or? Just... Um, I, uh, I don't. Mostly online. Uh, I met her in the West Series of Poker. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Dan is going to isolate here or raise it up rather. Suda just lets it go after completing from the second blind. Yeah, it was either the 32 or the full. <laughs> I changed my mind. <laughs> it's a tournament hand. Thank you, dude. Yeah, $200. Hand. It was a tournament. I'm definitely re raised. Oh, yeah. Dan, three betting that Jack do suited and Mike wakes up with Ace King suited. He's only got 15,000 behind. Seemed like a jam is in order. goes. Good luck, Mike. Dan's count. hand not not good enough to continue, but he's going to yeah. get a count to be sure. Let's it go. Highfly asks, does Hustler do any tournaments? My understanding is that there are no longer tournaments at Hustler, but all the, the tournaments associated with Larry Flint's properties are now at Lucky Lady down the street. And so you're there. Sunday, there's a pretty big tournament, for example. What are some other stuff you enjoy to do besides poker? Um, traveling, gaming, food. Yeah. Substances, recreational stuff. Yeah. Um, 300. <laughs> deep, di deep diving. My fault. My like fault. A thing. Deep, like deep water diving? No, like mental. Deep diving. Okay. Another free bet from Dan. Heads up. Nick makes the call. 5 3 suited. Okay. Dan checks it over. And the pair and backdoor clubs here. Dan won't be folding. Check. 
Nick checks this back. And Dan has the best of it. His ace kicker. Six thousand. Dan's actually going to bet here. Using a pretty big size, which is interesting. Very big size bet for fourth Five. pair. And he gets called. He overbets the pot with fourth pair and gets called by worse. Yeah, no, definitely not value. <laughs> he says he was bluffing. All right, Lauren here. You can look. Thank you, everyone. Wow. So, I, I guess trying to get Nick Airball to fold dark, dark a seven or something. <laughs> Does not work, and he accidentally <laughs> ends up getting a bunch of value. Such a huge percentage of Dan's plays have gone right tonight. Have you ever wanted to advertise on the number one poker show in the world, Hustler Casino Live? Hustler Casino Live has 1.5 million unique viewers per month. HCL also has 1.4 million watched live hours per month. Our viewers are 95% male, and 72% of them are between 25 and 50 years old, with an annual income over six figures, and they are very engaged. Our viewers are your customers. Let's build your brand and do some business. To learn more, visit us at hustlercasinolive.com slash sales. Knock your chips over, Dylan. Oh, Sorry. As long as you did it. <laughs> Did you lose a big one, Dylan? Yeah, yeah. Oh. I, I, I had trips against trips. Kicker. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice oh, time. It. it was a tough hand. Tough hand. Come on. I don't know. I could have been, been better, could have been worse. I think I lost the money. So, Mike X mm. going all in here. The King four. This would be a. Pretty wild call from Nick Airball, even though we see he's ahead. It looks like Nick is thinking about making it. Gigantic shove here relative to the pot. Nick is not in a folding mood here. More? A lot of draws out there, but they're not doing that badly against King 10 with two cards to come. Okay. Wow, he calls. Wow. Uh, <laughs> He's ahead. He's actually doing really well against King 4 of clubs. <laughs> Steiner is confused. I like real. Domination. <laughs> Hard for me to fold. Sorry. Wow, what a call. So Nick Airball wins the first run out. Sick play, Mike. I, I respect it. And the second run out as well, the 10 plays. Yeah. All right, you guys. Good luck. Thank and you. Mike X Mike. is going to head out. See you, buddy. He's about to go on a trip. Mentioned going to Indian 
India and Indonesia. So it'll be a few weeks before we see him again. King high like a boss. Big hand, hard Safe to Safe travels, Mike. All fun and games once the purples come out, eh, Nick? <laughs> what a call by Nick Classic. Airball. That was crazy. A whole different game now, right? Big mistakes Lock become very small Nick mistakes. Down. <laughs> Sick. Yeah, sick read, sick read, man. All right, guys, let me play some. Love you, buddy. Have a good trip. Be safe, yeah? Good game. See you, Mike. Good game, Mike. Take care. All right, Nick, we'll play two hours down here. You can go. You want to play for a few hours, then go? Yeah. That's, that's let's, well, let's figure it out after the stream. Okay. Right. I gotta check my phone and we can figure yeah. it out. Yeah. Ready for some carnage. Okay. Middle set for Dylan. Definitely a board where pocket eights can raise. Dylan goes for the call. <laughs> DGAF says, Indiana, Indonesia, beautiful this time of year. I wondered if somebody was going to call me out for that. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> now, Dylan's hand has been pretty significantly downgraded. And Dan win. bets big, and Dylan snaps it off. Yeah, Can't help myself. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Rare misstep from Dan. Send me, I'll give you. My, I'll send you my address after the stream. Slow roll, eh, right, Dylan? Mm -hmm. Slow roll. roll. <laughs> I didn't mean to slow roll. Yeah, if I did, I apologize. Uh, no. Mike, Mike wants you. My, my chips went in the exact same time yours went in. I, I, that's what I thought, right? I thought I made a pretty quick call. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> Definitely a snap. If you got a nine, you got a nine. <laughs> yeah, 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 for sure. Yeah. Every once in a while, what's that? Uh, no. Sickest call of all time. That's debatable. They made an investigation. Airball has yeah. your money? Yeah. No, I switched to this. Yeah. Spot. Yeah. Send it to me. Let me see if you call it Queen High. Uh, Don says, I've seen a guy make a castle, like an awesome castle, out of $1 chips at the casino. Never pay that player off when they bet the river. That's my, that's my little poker tip for the day. When they make a castle and they bet big on the river, don't pay them off. Free bet from Superman. Respectable tank. Yeah. Love him. I feel like you made your mind up a long time ago, but out of just purely out of courtesy. Uh, <laughs> out of courtesy. Oh, yeah, the, fake, the fake tank? <laughs> yeah. Not fake tank, but like. Yeah. I definitely wanted to put it in right away, but then I was like, I, I almost put it in, and I was like, mm -hmm. just out of respect. Like, no, yeah. I was like, I just need to think about this before I just put in 16,000 here with King High. Like, I just like, maybe. Because yeah, it's, like, it's not going to be good if you're wrong, for sure. <laughs> yeah, I was like. <laughs> I was like, what's the worst case scenario? He has a six and I'm just dead, I guess. It's impossible, so I'll go with it. It's like the uh, opposite highlight reel you're looking for. Thomas Morris says, Indiana here. Thanks for the shout out. You're welcome. My girlfriend's from Indiana. Or maybe India. Thank you so much. What a flop here. <laughs> Straight for Mariano. A set for Nick Arabal. Nick Arabal paid Mariano off light a half hour or so ago. Mariano had quads. And now Nick Arabal thinks he's got him right where he wants him. But Mariano's got the nuts. 
Again. Well, three spades out there now. And Nick Arabal knows that this is not a good card for him. Nick Arabal gets there on the river. Full house. Luckily for Mariano, it's in a way that allows him to not lose too much money. Four to a straight and a flush coming out on the turn. Already significantly downgraded his hand. Now the board pairs. And Nick Airball bets 2x pot. And I think ordinarily you can just fold a hand like this, but does Mariano think that Nick Airball is getting way out of line because Nick just lost that huge pot to him a half hour ago? I think this spot is really more about the dynamic between these two players than about the cards exactly. Two Kobe's from Nick Airball. situation for Mariano on the flop. It's turned into something else here on the river. Sorry guys. This was going to take me a minute. No Sorry Nick. Mariano has a 10 in his hand but still loses to a ton of full houses. Maybe some flushes as well. Although I don't know if flushes or queen jack type hands use this sizing. Nick Airball just looks massively tilted though. terrible run out for 10-7 though after having flopped the nut straight everything gets there Mariano still has the calling chips in his hand One more minute. Nick Airball. Clock on myself. Just can't decide. Staring at the board. You good with that? One minute. Looking straight ahead. Not responding to Mariano's attempt to engage. Ordinarily, this can be a fold, but Nick Airball's tilt makes it so hard. Mariano eventually does get out of the way. 
maybe not the, the hardest fold of all time, but a pretty hard one, honestly, given the dynamic oh, between these two players. Oh, frustrating run out. The one time I get out of line with you, Nick, 10-7 off. <laughs> The one time I get out of line. Damn it. Instant punish. Yeah, what's up? What? Oh. Oh. Oh shit, sorry Mike. I took like the longest the longest uh tank of all time. I try not to watch that hand back very often. Yeah. What do you say? How much time? Yeah, it's pain. Like less than an hour. Less than an hour. Mike X paying Mariano back there. Mariano returns to the table in time to raise. Checks back and Dan picks up some outs here. He'll bluff. And Dan hits a flush on the river. He squeeze a little bit more value out. Maybe not against this exact hand, but seems like the kind of guy who will try, and he does. Not really. I, I have no idea what I was doing there, to be honest. <laughs> just like, uh, just like so random there. So Dan... By far the biggest winner now, up $75,000. Mariano up 49000 Nick Airball now up 32000 despite all the tilt. And Mike down 140000 and out for the evening. And for the next several weeks as he goes on a trip. Our cumulative winnings are courtesy of Odds Jam. Short, we started out short-handed, so it's kind of like slow. Along the whole time, yeah. Yeah. Re raised from Dan. Sort of Dylan. Yeah. Makes the call. I see the lineup. I'm like, I love, <laughs> okay, this, I love this guy. And <laughs> a flush draw for awesome. Dan. Yeah. Charmin. How do you say no to free money, right? This guy. <laughs> I heard Lawrence Billy. You got it. Down. And that'll be good enough to take it down. <laughs> Dan has three bet something like 90 times tonight. And has won about 83 of those hands. Do I do I do it, Mariana? Do I do it? I don't know, man. They say tight is right. But yeah, you better do it. Eight. But I love okay, being is wrong. Is that 16 coming on? <laughs> That's right. All right. OK, this is. Four this might be uh, this might be the one. Might be the one. So it's on V1. 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 Easy points. Yoda, what's up? Hi. 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 Welcome I to the one, two, four, eight, sixteen game. <laughs> one, two, four, eight, sixteen. You see how many big blinds have? Yeah, how well, can you miss it? How are you, man? You look good. Did you lose weight or something? Did you lose weight? Yeah. Good for you. Nice. Good for you, man. What are you laughing at, I was praying for ASAP. Uh, this is mine. I For sure. Wait. Played with Yoda a little bit Sorry. at Lucky Lady in 1020 a few weeks ago. Great guy. Let's see if he sits down here. Queen here for Nick. Dan doesn't have a whole lot. I had the same hand god I had last it. time the big straddles were on. King Queen, big hand. Oh my god. I thought I turned you dead. 
You don't play any hands. <laughs> he called all room. He's queen. Yeah. I was such a nice fucking with... hand. I have king queen. Such oh. a nice hand. Yeah, too. Five. Fucking suited ba uh, natural eight. Oof. Yeah. Do you have a heart? No. No heart. You're dead. Yoda. You're dead. Up. Professional pachinko player. Nick, you're dead. Up. Just wait one hand. Uh, right? 20. He's not here to wait. 20. Let's go. 300. Okay. Atta boy. Got it. Good to see you, Yoda. Yeah. He's not, he's not long waiting. Long time. Yeah, yeah, long time. <laughs> long time. Oh, this is a nice shirt. Yoda. Steiner. Yoda. Oh, he's on a heater. Yoda, what's Yoda. Yoda. What brand is that shirt? Um, Maybe it's, it's a, they're Japanese one ships. I can buy it for you. I don't know they have my size in Japan. <laughs> <laughs> just take two of them. So I just bought. Yeah. Oh, Nick. Nice to see you, buddy. Praise. Yeah, same here. Uh, Glad to see you again. Look at these spots, King Queen. Insane. Mm -hmm. Insane. Jack ate a diamond, too. Like, I was ready. Are you Jack ate a diamond? Free yeah, money right like, away, Yoda? Yeah, Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Super interesting spot. Yeah, welcome. Like, only for his. Don't get shot. Right back. So, $300 straddle from Yoda. Mine 10x, and we can just go to work. As he sits down Thank here, you, and <laughs> Mariano pops middle pair and takes it down. I just think the jam. They're getting called, bro, for sure. I know. Let's turn it straight. <laughs> At least five off. <laughs> for sure getting called. I mean, suited. Go yeah. with it. I'm yeah. suited too, man. I can't go the, with opposite. The big straddle's on. I can't fold anything. Not much of a folder when the big straddle's on. That was a perfect spot. I missed it. Yeah, Modelo, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Damn, Dan, you're still going Thousand? strong. I yeah, I, honestly, I don't, I didn't, uh... King Queen suited for Dylan. I don't usually yeah. get buzz off ears, but yeah. Free bet from stomach, Superman. <laughs> and does Mariano want a four bet here? I recently found out Thirsty Thursday means you, everyone drinks. Yes. I didn't know that. Yeah. But they also play very small. Dylan was ready to call. They they had like call chip. You saw me play that, Wednesday and that's why you raised. Like. But that's why I'm wondering what the hell's going um, on. I did not see you, Dylan. You didn't? If I did, I might have. I might have pussied out, you know? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know about that. I've been known to uh, <laughs> to be afraid. Hey, don't listen to the chat. Mm -hmm. 28? 28. Oh, yeah, hold on. So Dylan, warm. cold calls the four bet, and that'll bring in Superman as well. And you'd like to say that's a good flop for fives, but in a four-bet pot, that's not necessarily the case. Really hard to hang on. Mariano bets, and how much pressure does he want to put on suited Superman here? So you think that Superman would probably put in more money with aces or kings when it's three ways pre-flop. Probably with queens also. So he has a lot of one pair type hands here. He's got pocket tens also. And by one pair type hands, I mean pocket pair type hands. And not the strongest ones. Eleven thousand from Mariano on the turn. That'll get 
Thank you, bro. Not the worst. Superman to surrender. The worst buff catcher. Pocket fives. Wow. Hearts yeah. and spades. Hearts and spades. How do you know? Good. You're too good. He's too good. <laughs> I do. I have. To, did, I, I have to say three words and he know in my hand. <laughs> that phone's on air bar. Jesus. I got. Superman's exact I combo of pocket fives water. blocks. In the, <laughs> the ace five <laughs> suited that have flush have. draws, <laughs> like, which is what these two players are talking right, about. Move on. I only did that because I saw Dylan about to call it pretty <laughs> Like he said, his genius uh, observation. And, and I know you, your po favorite hand is pocket four, so I have too, <laughs> I have I knew, too many live calls. I knew I had two, two outs. Exactly, yeah. But I don't know, maybe, maybe not. Steiner bumps it up from a very short stack. Dylan makes the call. Really awkward spot for Superman here. He three bets it. It's kind of awkward because if Steiner has a value hand, he's just going to shove and Superman is going to have to call, but that's not the case this time. And nice Superman gets everybody to fold. I had to call a thousand. I didn't have to call three. Five, <laughs> you know. Two five, I call. Three five. Uh, yeah, two five. Too small. Too small. Yeah. Thought about exactly. three. Yeah. Thought about yeah. five more. That was, that was <laughs> smart to add the five. For 2,000, I might, two chips, I might, I might call it. Okay, he's shove, I can fold. You add, you add another <laughs> chip to it, I don't know. Where's... Dan? He's good, he's just grabbing my hand. Sorry, I'm sorry. He's ridiculous. Yeah. Dan, let me get your drink this time. All right. It's the cheap one, right? Only if you drink it. Never mind. It's fair. You can pay, Dan. Dan has been drinking all night, too, while playing like a complete boss. Is that Dante Fong? It's not one close by, though, right? DoorDash. Fuck, you DoorDash that? Start with 10, right, Yoda? I start with 20. 20, thank you. I can't even think of, I think there might be one at 4. Isn't that where we are? We're like 20 minutes from Florence, maybe 30. It takes like an hour to get here. It's not cold or anything? It's fine. So Yoda opens, couple calls, you and a clean on the turn for Superman. I went to the, the, the Taifung and Aria, like I actually went in there. It's mm -hmm. fucking nice. It's nice of what are the best restaurants there? I know you stay there. Yeah, this is the one. I haven't been to Carpoli yet. I hear it's really good. Yoda bets and I usually do like Superman calls. Treat this queen as a bluff catcher. Uh, queen. And win a small one. Have you stayed at their like Sky Suites? Oh, Lauren. Nice. Let's go. Nice enough. Teamwork, my dream work. What's like a. Oh, I say out loud? <laughs> the Wailius Rangers in Vegas. Mm. I hear Caesars has some crazy shit. Uh, yeah, probably the one that Wesley was staying at. Caesars. 
it's like a whole floor or something. <laughs> it was like two floors. Jesus. You're playing Kayla with us after the stream, right? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Or I mean, they're all Peter bad. Yeah. Oh, you're the Lauren who, uh, <laughs> <laughs> the infamous <laughs> the infamous Lauren. Just that just makes a lot of sense. Yeah. 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 A lot of money playing Rock Around. Yeah. The four card Lauren. It's 17. Free bet from Dan, because why not? Well, Steiner wakes up with a real hand. Great spot for him to just rip his chips in. In they go, 7,500. And <laughs> Dan's going to need to count now, I think. Getting pretty good odds here. You could see that Steiner had ace king, he would definitely call. Sure. Dan makes Twice. the call. Sure. Has to be pretty happy with what he sees here. So you wanted to see it? Yeah. Shots. <laughs> Five. Steiner wins the first run out. And that second run out is all Steiner as well. For the sweat. So Dan will double him up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That is weird. Lucky, uh, like, lucky 10 ball that you found on the ground out there. Yeah, the you, if you pull them this way and they, <laughs> wow, that's weird. Well, ready for the tournament tomorrow. Now I'm ready for the it's tournament game. tomorrow. Okay. Tournament. Okay. Here we go. He'll be fully ready once he. Oh, punts that away. Yeah, let me <laughs> let me dust this off real quick and then I'll be ready. All right, he's still got like 10 minutes to, to blast off of that. Steiner has ever played the like the puck ante game where the small blind can win it? Yeah. 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 Not won a lot of hands tonight. Play that game. That's why I called. Now you speak up, man. <laughs> <laughs> Where do you normally play at? Yeah. Mostly Toronto. Yeah. yeah, but like like in a casino or something? No, private game. Oh, okay. Yeah. <sighs> casino games probably don't have anything that big, right? Yeah, no. Niagara Falls. And... Niagara Falls is like a tourist trap. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. I was there once. Um, yeah, I think they have like a 2-5 game. That was their biggest game. <clears throat> Yeah. Once again. Race from Dylan. Sorry, Dylan. And I'll Canada. take my walk. I'll take Canada. my walk. No one has a whole lot. Exactly okay. Just tip for some of my money. What about that? So don't forget, we we'll be back after the weekend in a Max Payne yeah, Monday. Get another round. Rampage will be there to play Max Payne Monday, and you can win a seat. Come to Hustler and play. Um, what were we drinking? Because uh, we'll be giving out a seat to a random um, seated player. Three. As well as a yeah. $5,000 yeah. steak. Last time we did this. Uh, that's three. The player won $6,500 or something like that on Max Pay Monday. So if you're in LA, come out to Hustler on Monday. 
Okay. And I fold because you try to get that. your seat in the game. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to uh, <laughs> just mess up your feng shui. <laughs> Check. Dan flops the best of it here. <laughs> Check. This king is mostly a brick here. Dan can try to squeak out a little bit more value. That's small, seems good, and Mariano folds. Race from Yoda. Dylan. Big slick. Sorry. Yoda. Not really deep enough to speculate here. He folds. Button raise from Mariano. Pretty sure Dan's not folding. Sure? Yeah, wasn't right. sure. Not a lot going on for either player. Mariano with some back doors and position. That's big and Dan gets out of the way. That'll be it. As you look at our chip counts, courtesy of Odds Jam. Again, don't forget to rejoin us on Monday at 5 for Max Payne Monday with Rampage. Dan playing the most hands tonight, 51%. Mariano at 42%. Dan and Mariano also the most aggressive players pre-flop. And Dan and Mariano, the two biggest winners. That's quite the trifecta for those two. Dan winning $64,000. I'm Charlie Wilmoth. Thanks for watching Hustler Casino Live.